This shit about to be funny as hell. Yeah. Oh my god. Go. I like that setting for you. I'm not going to chase those account down. You know that, the drill. The greenery, because it's like, like the greenery <laughs> with the eyes, Ireland, the with the Irish. I don't do giving. shit without chase those countdown. I love Nola. I haven't seen her in too long. It's giving. It's been Let's too do long. it. I'm down. I miss you. Wage you group. Come and see me. I'm gonna come, come see you, Nola. Me. All right, I'm, I'm with that. Let's get it. I just want to say from the bottom of my heart, I'd like to take this chance to apologize to absolutely nobody. <laughs> So the one and only Cy Irie is here, man. I'm talking about Cy Irie the Kid. Cy Irie's in the building, man. The Cy Irie the Kid. Cy Irie the Kid. I am Cy Irie, but I am not sorry. It's the Cy Irie Not Sorry Show, motherfuckers. Oh, yeah. Episode three. <laughs> uh, we did something a little different on format this week, y'all. We don't bring out. These are these are the first guests. Y'all are popping the Cy Irie Not Sorry Show cherry. Y'all the first guests. Like, we ain't had nobody else come through uh so welcome to the show you know Thank what i'm saying you. um we're gonna introduce our guest man this is ashley aka queen nola you know what's going on what if they oh, don't wait, what if they don't no know what's going on oh well if you don't now you do it don't right. matter don't worry about it cool. just be natural what, what's your name state your name gangster can we start over I'm Kayla. we ain't starting over nothing <laughs> <laughs> nah, say that again, oh my god huh say that again Kayla. That's not, oh Kaylin my god Kaylin castle <laughs> yeah speak up what's the hassle <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Tough crowd. Um, Tough crowd. <laughs> what is it about Atlanta that does the you know what the f- going on? Like that's so Atlanta. I remember when I first moved to Atlanta and I was doing open mics and every rapper that touched Said the stage that. would be like, "Yo, it's Lil Bromeo. You know what the f- going on, big homie." <laughs> So much yeah. for not cursing in the first five minutes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, we're going to send to the... I'm just saying, she's... <laughs> I was following the whole Because I, I, that's what I picked I up. And I good... just feel like, like, even if you don't know what the f*** is going on, when somebody says it, you know what the f*** is going on at that time. Hell yeah. Like, yeah. Chase getting his money's worth <laughs> on that. <It's, laughs> yeah. Chase getting his money's worth on that. Nah, you know, you know what would have been dope, though? What? Is if a rapper says that, and then you and you go, wait, I don't know, I don't know what's going on. Would you do that? I never know what's going I'm on. I'm saying, would you do that, though, if I paid you to do that? But it, it got to be a real street dude, though. Okay, so, so I'm risking my life. I mean, just see what he does. If you just Who see, is he? See if he has an answer. See if he or tells she. you. Street dude. Or she. Or she. If I'm I feel like rapper, all the real motherfuckers in Atlanta gone anyway, so. <laughs> Get him the fuck out of here. Yo, we Where they good? <laughs> hey, Chase, Down we're going to start doing fines. I'm going to make you do extra is. work. Every time P, can curse? we do that? Can we start fining, oh? Yo. Can we start what? <laughs> Finding, oh? You know what I'm saying? Know what like, saying? like an athlete? <laughs> That's crazy. We took their mic away. How y'all day started? That's a good question. Did you wake up in your skin today? Yeah, I did that. I did How your that. day started? Sai, my days be a blur. Like what? Like I woke up and then I'm here. Alarm or just straight off of God's no, sunlight? No, no, no. Yeah, just God's touch. Woke For up. real? Yeah. <laughs> Getting touched by God is crazy. <laughs> How you wake up? Blessed. I'm highly favored. For real? Mm-hmm. Sleep with all your clothes on? No, I sleep naked. Y'all sleep naked? Me too, yeah, even in the winter. Buck mm-hmm. naked with no one in the bed with you? Yeah, butt naked. Girls do that. I sleep better butt Don't naked when nobody's with me. When no, it, because it came in my mouth. I ain't I was, I wasn't gonna It came in your mouth. Dang. How y'all feel about a dude sleeping naked by himself? We already talked about this. How you feel about it? I don't have an issue with a, uh, a man sleeping naked. I don't like it because I feel like who does fuck? Like, why are you sleeping naked? Like, you ready for something? What if it's for me? It's like you too ready or something. Like, who does fuck? What if it's for me? What if in the middle you're of the by night? You're yourself. One you're second because I was speaking. Uh, what, what is if, this? A man's world? Yes. <laughs> no, it's and not. And you're here by invite only. Um, <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what if in the no. middle of the night it's for me and I wake up to me and I beat off to me? But and I don't feel like you have to one be naked second, for and that. I go back to sleep to Wait, me. You said you I just pull out the hole in the boxers like Rosie O'Donnell. You, you said you masturbate to yourself. <laughs> That's too much for me. You don't jack off to your thoughts. You said to yourself, not to your. I'm thoughts. saying when girls, when y'all play with y'all, y'all don't play with yourself. Yeah, but it's not called jacking off because we don't. Have what do y'all call it? DJing, finger bang, DJing, DJing. I don't um, finger myself. Play really? the guitar. Waka, waka, waka. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. DJ. One second. Whatever y'all do, y'all do it to you alls thoughts or do y'all need material? Mm. I'm creative. I'm. I have my yeah. I'm got a big imagination. Wild. I yeah. guess. For I real. Need it. Mm. Yeah. It don't gotta be on no porn. Like on the on the phone on the porn. No. 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 You you know what does it for me on the phone? Porn don't do it for me no more. Mm. But like if if someone, I feel so bad for women. And if this has happened to if you, someone this, can see it. Huh? Someone can see it. No, I said say it. Say it. 
I don't know what you're st- You need a translator <laughs> while you're on here. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck you're saying. If you someone could say it. You got fucking um, Nelson Mandela on the fucking podcast. I don't know what you No, but it's okay. I've been to Bermuda once. But listen. No, you haven't. I will. Not yet. But listen. Why are you lying? I think it's just lying. For no, no that's You just be lying. Oh, I don't know. Right. No, but you're not so funny lying. anyway. So we lying. Okay, you man. Listen, lying. Hold on. Y'all, y'all used to it. It's cool. You ever, be, you ever be like horny as fuck and mm-hmm. you text in the joint and get her to talk nasty to you and then you get off no. and then you just stop talking to her? No. 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 Yeah. no. When I was talking to the what dude you mean that was locked up no. in person, he that's was like That's phone set. That's like a weird version of phone set. I don't talk nasty to No, no, no. So real shit, real shit. There might be a chick I'm not that crazy about. And then, like, one morning or something, I'll be, like, horny as fuck. So I'll text her, like, damn, I miss you. And then we get to, like, talking nasty. She starts sending some nasty pics. So text or talk? Whatever the fuck. A text. Let's say she starts sending some nudes. Mm-hmm. I beat off to them. Something about the thrill of, like, a real, like, porn don't do it for me no more. Something about a real human mm. interacting with me, texting my phone, then sending the nudes and the buck mm. naked so you- twerk videos. One second. Yeah. And then I beat <laughs> off to it. <laughs> And then I'm like, and then Stop I let him one second. You by the way, this Kayla. can't be real life. Kayla, Kayla, curse that real. nigga out, Kayla. Kayla. Show him the spice. Show, show him the Bermuda spice. Kayla, real shit. And then I get my post nut clarity where I'm like, damn, I don't even like her. And then I just stop texting her. But I, I was that. hyping her for thirty minutes until so I got my nut. So you masturbate to pictures? Yeah, I can't. Yeah, yeah, pictures and videos from real doing. people. I'm not. Gets me off. I mean, porn. People but it's like, bro. It's like, oh, hold on, bro. If you say if you start, first of all, be how being off is a quick process. Well. It don't take me that long to Sometimes get. Sometimes I savor it because I gotta. That's what I'm saying. What if she takes a minute for the picture to come? I'm through? in there and I'm 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 s- doing the drink, rolling. doing the doing the drink, doing the drink. Wait, so do you start before the picture comes through, or do you start doing once the, the drink? That's what I'm saying, bro. Come be through. Through. Thirty minutes. How did the picture some, never come? Yeah, what if you take a minute? The picture never comes, and you already started. Then, then you never come. Side note: What's your password? I'm not even doing that. Okay. It's some white boy shit. No, 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 no. It's not some white boy shit. I'm not even doing that. Don't single it out. Now, I'm not even doing You know what I realized didn't work too? I tr- I, I tried this multiple times to, to get off to a video that's homemade by me. I don't like that. It's like it's like tickling yourself. It don't work. It well, do you, work. Then what's the purpose of taking a video? If you... I don't know. Like, it you don't, don't like your own content? I don't get as rock <laughs> as I would as watching Cherokee get off to Mr. Marcus. I oh, don't. No, 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 because I've seen that too many times. Wait, my, wh- which one have you seen too many times? The Cherokee and Mr. Oh, Marcus. Oh. But I'm saying my own shit, I'm like. My own video. It, it rekindles it. Nah. It's all coming back nah, to cause, me Nah, because like I'm looking at me. Now I'm like overly looking at me. It's crazy. What do you mean uh, overly looking at you? I don't know. I don't want to see myself. While I'm through. I ain't beat off in a while, though, but like when I used to. Yeah, back, you don't even know. You don't like how you look on camera? No, no, no. I look good. It's just like I'll be like, it's me, though. Oh, fan, sorry. yeah, she want me to put my thumb on it. <laughs> so she said, to unlock yeah. it. So I put you know the whole thing in her ass. <laughs> what? Um, <laughs> what'd you guys think of the Drake cock video this week? Did you guys gander at that? I looked at it. Is it real? I don't Is know it? if it's real or not, but I looked at it. I looked at it too, and let me tell you something. Not you looked at it too. No, oh, yeah, are we on? <laughs> oh. No, I'm just kidding. Wait, yo. <laughs> But I heard of it, and I didn't like. I didn't like the feedback. You, really? Is it I sex tape? Is it a, what is it? No, it's just him laying in the bed. Doing his oh, thing. really? Oh no. Okay. Hold on one second. Can really? I ask you a question? Yeah. The feedback. I didn't see the video. <laughs> <laughs> but, but the feedback on the line from the women. I saw mostly positive things. I, it was I positive. Really? I saw no. positive stuff too. I did. What? Like My what? Feed was People going crazy. were saying. Like, no, no. What did y'all think? What did I think of the actual video? First of all, I don't like when men send me videos of them like. Okay. I don't like when men send me that's... videos of them. So you don't like news? I don't like that. Sorry. Y'all don't like news? Who news? Mm-mm. I don't take dick pics. Or n- I don't send news. Not anymore. I don't know. Never did. Never did. If 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 they're like asked for, like the the ones that be like without no, permission, that shit crazy. Like I'm finna block you. I ain't good. asking for that. Oh y'all be getting without block. permission? Yeah, all the, time. all the time. Yeah. Let me tell you something. I'm finna block you now. I've been taking dick pics for a long time. Okay. So, which, what's your angle? Do you do okay. permission or with permission? Well, well what is permission? What's your angle? If somebody oh, says, what what is consent? <laughs> Listen, what is, what is this consent? This is not <laughs> this is not consent. That's what that's not. <laughs> no, but listen, real shit. Can I tell y'all a funny story? <laughs> Junior year of high school, I was dating this chick. She wasn't ratchet, but her name was Datika. All right, we don't got to talk about you it. You always bring Datika. I huh? like Datika though. Classic. Where is she now? Chocolate. Well, Datika, if you see this, I let your boy. I was dating this chick, Datika. 
and this other chick was trying to holler. This is like early. This is before iPhones, by the way. And I sent the other chick a dick pic. Oh, so you do do that. Got it. Go ahead. And then everybody in school started telling everybody that I sent Shorty a dick pic, and then Datika broke up with me because I sent Shorty a dick pic. Damn. But then Shorty I sent a dick pic to mm -hmm. sucked me off in my driveway. So it worked out. Lose win? It was a lose win. I lost the Wait, So did other people see your dick pic? Ma'am? Did other people see your dick pic? Or they just yeah. highlighted it? And did it matter to you? No. You didn't care if people saw your My, dick pic or not? No. So was you it said, worth it, though? So you're saying you have a big dick? That dick pic shit is I didn't crazy. say anything. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yo. What does Picasso. that mean? Because I heard I white guys like how, how do you? How do you wait, wait. It? We can off topic. We were talking about the full, fucking Drake uh, shit. Right. And we were talking. No, but let me tell you the angle, though. So, yeah. Because <laughs> I asked you your angle. When you take a dick pic, what's your angle? Is this your angle? Yeah, this is Because Drake was, crazy. he was laying in I bed. Like, he had his legs kind of. I was about to say, up, I like Drake's up. angle. Listen. But <laughs> 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 no, my angle, I like the angle. Was, uh, one second, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to reenact. I like the angle. That Drake did. I like, so I, did I like the angle in the bed. Oh, he did. You in the whole joint? <laughs> Ma'am? The angle? Ma'am, it's crazy. You in the whole joint? Me in the whole joint? Are you in the... If you send the pic, do you cry? I don't, I don't... One second. I don't like the pic from the top of the dick. Bird's eye view dick pic. I don't like that. Why? I just don't like it. I don't like how it looks on cam. It's almost like when you take a selfie. I don't like it. It's because you got a little... <laughs> no, it, the tummy is more money for the tummy. But I'm saying <laughs> I like the angle from... Like, I got to reach. But are you in... You, you looking at the camera? Yeah, I'm like leaning on the other side of my dick like that. Got you, got you. <laughs> but it's it's from underneath slash behind the dick. Yeah, I ain't doing all that. I ain't doing that. I don't use mirrors and angles. I'm not and, doing yeah, Drake that. Drake was in the mirror. I give a shorty like the video. I'll let her do record us and her phone. I'm cool with that. But I'm not. Record. Yeah, like if we was doing something, then like there's no circumstance in which you would do it. No. What if it was like wifey or something? No. You're married. Had to, you're married and your wife she on a road had to, trip. She had to get it herself. Because cause there's no way for me to pose to do it. So you just want it. her to be like, can I take a picture of your dick? What you mean? Like how nah, you she just going to have to catch it spontaneously. Like, wow. What is a spontaneous I'm, catch? I'll be in the shower, in the bed, something like that, and just so catch it. So is it the angles you don't like? Yeah, it's this, or is this, it just there's, the, there's no cool way to do that. Like, what this, if you you're set out of your mind. and put it's it on no, the timer? And there's a lot of cool ways. I don't care if you pose like Denzel, nigga. It ain't going to look cool. No, there's a lot of cool ways. If you've never done it, it, you don't know. Who the top three coolest niggas? Denzel, Idris Alba, and LL Cool J. All three of them niggas, it's going to look weird. No, it's not. There's no not. cool way you've to take it. You've never done it. You don't know. I'm not doing you it. You can put your leg up like Jack Daniels. No, really do? definitely not. I mean, no. <laughs> Captain Morgan. I'm sorry, y'all. Captain Morgan, I think bro. if I did my first joint, I'd do it in like a jail pose. What's, What's the jail, jail pose? pose? You know. What's that? Getting raped? Happen. Put your hands cuffed? Nah, what? Like, you, know how, oh. you know how niggas like when they, when they first get out and they put you, you know what I mean? Oh, like that? You would do it like that? That's the only way I could do it. That's it looks like you're taking a shit and that's the cool. that's the same I would do it like I take my, you know my first, you know my pose, my nigga. All my pictures is like this. Except for But that not when your dick's be. out. See, Have next. some creativity. <laughs> yeah, can we move on? <laughs> next. <laughs> I'm lost here. Oh, wait, before we move on, I didn't see the Drake video, but I did read the comments. Like I said, my T.O. was They was cooking them? They weren't fucking with it. What was they and saying? They was saying like it was, you know, a little lazy and it was like a lazy. little skinny and that's like, I don't know. It was, yeah, it was long like and that. skinny. It was long and skinny? Yeah. That's what they say. It was like pencil. Hey, that's not Penciled my business. I don't, give, I don't give a fuck. Okay, next. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what y'all oh. think, like when y'all in a relationship, right? Mm-hmm. Women always tell a man to keep it a buck, right? Mm -hmm. Like, be honest with me. Mm -hmm. Fucking tell me the truth, Jamal. Mm -hmm. Why is that always, is that always <laughs> your black name? Y'all been watching. No, I just know you. <laughs> Y'all fans, for real. Why is it always Jamal? I just um, know you. <laughs> it's just a good go-to name, standard okay. street name. Um, but yeah, they want they want you to keep it a buck with them. They want you to be honest with them. Uh -huh. But um, can y'all really hear that? Like, version of an honest motherfucker, for real? Or like... Can y'all handle the truth for real? Yeah. Like, y'all be saying y'all want a motherfucker to be honest, but me being honest jeopardizes us now. No, it doesn't. It does. It don't. If a nigga keep it real, if you say, you know how girls say, like, just keep it with, just keep it real with me from the jump. Mm -hmm. If a nigga keeps it real, and I'm talking about his keeping it real being not over the top, like, I just got my dick sucked yesterday. Because mm -hmm. some of y'all do ask that stupid question, like, when's the last time you had sex? Which mm -hmm. we hate that question. We never tell y'all the truth, by the way. We don't even, some smart niggas don't even answer. I tell y'all the truth. <laughs> but <every> time. but <laughs> what, I'm, what I'm asking is, 
if a nigga actually, so I'm talking about you like him though. Mm-hmm. Not a nigga that you just consider, like you like this nigga. Mm-hmm. And he tells you, I, I do got a couple shorties. You know, he not like sleeping with his baby mom and doing extra drama shit, but he got bitches in his phone. Mm-hmm. He texts some girls. He's cool with mad girls. He might kick it with some, he might, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Do you still move forward with him? Yeah. With the same way that you would have moved if he lied and you didn't find out? Yeah, I'm not trying to be an indie bitch. I'm trying to be a favorite. But, so, yeah, I was, exactly. I, I was going to say I, I, I do. Hear that. I hear that, but do you still have options? What do you mean? Because every girl when she talking to Even a nigga be acting talking, like, oh, no I'm only. Else. Every girl be like, I'm, I'm only talking to you right now. Girls run that. So you're what, never, even if you're not fucking anyone else, you're always gonna have options. Like you? especially, well, me, yeah. I'm talking I'm about saying, me. will y'all still be entertaining niggas if he tells you I the mean, truth? It de- it depends at what phase am I at? Am I in a re- I'm in a full blown relationship? It's not a relationship. I mean, just fucking it's like it, y'all, y'all talking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just starting to talk. Y'all had sex. Yeah, then I'm entertaining. Like, some, yeah, what do you call entertaining? There, what's entertaining? You, you know, wanna, man. Like, can a nigga? <laughs> can another nigga take you on a date? Mm. What's a date? Man, come on with that shit, man. <laughs> yeah, a, 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 a nigga, what's your definition a nigga of a take day, you, like... I, I take you to Cheetah, y'all go eat. He come paid. Come on, why would you say that? You know? I mean, that, we just crazy. you just said Cheetah a hundred times when we started. That so. part out. No, here it is. Shit. Where the fuck I be that's going on? That's Cheetah, 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 Cheetah. You know what I'm saying? Maybe. So y'all telling me y'all cool with that? So maybe it depends. It depends, and and I'm I'm a curious person, and just because I want to see, like, okay, well, what type of bitch? Because if you're talking about like you got bitches and this one's a librarian, no shade, or this or that, and I'm doing this, it's like we're not even in the same type of time for real. So are you just like trying some new shit with me or is this what the fuck you be doing? That's different. Mm. If it's what the fuck you be doing, then it's like, cool. I'm look. Y'all really want the truth. No, I want the I truth. D- I do personally. I like that I like to have an option. I don't like being like Lied to. I don't like being tricked. It's no, that's shit. real. That's I can real. walk away. If I don't like it. Right. I can say. Lay it on the table I, for but, me. But, let me but I will still have respect for you, though. I'm not leaving on a bad note. As in, like, yo, we could still be cool, whatever. And if we just want to listen it down to like, we could just fuck. If that's the case, if I don't like actually trying to oh, be with you, oh yeah, we can, I, can, I on, like can I be honest? Can be honest? Can y'all st- stop fucking asking that? Stop. stop. I never stop. asked that. My, the 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 whole thing of this, I feel like. Women need to stop. It's like, why Why am I taking the SAT test and school just started? What do you mean? Why the fuck are you asking me prime like questions? Too, but it's like, it's like, it's like hold on, hold on. When's the last time you no, asked? Like, I asked. I'm just, I'm just asked. asked. The question, my, niggas, my what's your body count? count? Hold the f- oh. nah. no. Uh-huh. no. Hold the fuck No, 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 no. Hey, hey, no, hey, I'm, I'm, hey. I'm, I'm, I'm serious. This is running wild. No. <laughs> <laughs> where, where, where's that from? Where's that from? No, no, it's a line. We, we're not just going on. Yeah, tough crowd. It's from four year old version. Call you back. But um, a side note, um, <laughs> for comfort. No, for real though. Why does that? Why do these questions uh, have to be asked so soon? What do you mean? What's I so feel, soon? I just feel like it should be a time where y'all kind of see where it's going. Like let shit flow naturally before. Now I I get it. There's a time where you got to break it off and be like, okay, you know. I'm going to put, put the rules on the table. We didn't, we didn't got this far, but it's going nowhere. So let's see if we're going to go to another level. Can we keep it a fucking buck, bro? Yeah. Women start asking that shit because they get dick whipped and they excited. And they Not sprung. Necessary. One second. They sprung early on. This nigga's crazy. And, 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 no, one and one now second. they need reassurance. Oh, my God. I'm catching feelings. I want to have his children and fuck them every second. Oh, my God. Am I the only one? Just hey. tell me the truth. Tell me yeah, the truth. Hitting. That's what happens. It's, you, y'all never asking a lame to tell you the truth. Y'all never asking some. No, that's not true. It is true. No, we don't. First of all, ask, why would I be fucking with a lame, lame person to tell you the truth? Because we already know. We no, don't no, ask no. a real nigga the truth. But First of all, we don't even want to know that. We don't even care. It's that motherfucker that y'all get excited about. That's not true. Yes, it is. The motherfucker that y'all get excited about. Y'all want to know, like, am I, is, is this real? No. Can I touch it? No, that's your opinion. No. I mean, that might be some bitches. That, but I'm that's not all bitches. Because for me, my favorite question is, have you fucked someone since me? Depends how, like, you know, that's my favorite question. I don't ask that but you either. never going to get the real answer if he ask. did it, though. You, he, uh, no nigga going to tell you the, the real answer. Why ask No, that? that's not true. All right. That's not true. The last okay. time I, I asked that ask question, that. I got okay. the truth. Okay. Did I? <laughs> you probably, yeah, I mean, maybe. No. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> no. <laughs> all right, good luck. Shit. Anyway. Honestly, I'm going to go so far as, like, with you. <laughs> I could be knee deep with a nigga. A nigga go to open his phone. You know what I do? 
Bitch, I don't even want to fucking see. You know, I ain't good. I'm not asking. Mm. Why would I hurt? Like, because you expecting the worst. My already. feelings yeah. don't get hurt. If you open your, if you was to open but, your phone right now, I promise to God, I'm looking this way. But this I don't is even this is why see. I didn't I didn't mm. like how how the scenario was set up in a sense. Let's let's take it as a man who. I don't but, know. God damn. Let, let's stop moving it. Tighten it. I didn't even touch Queer. it. Let's take it as a man who like you're you're super excited about, right? Hypothetically, you get a feeling early on. You're like. Damn, he, he really seemed like he all for me. He don't be doing shit else. He either he either get into the bag or he whoop de whoop de whoop. But it's like I don't I don't even think he got hoes for like what does it take for you to for the same way like men always get judged like men are dogs and shit. What does it take for a woman to be exclusive? What do you mean? Before I answer that, I want to speak on when you said, "Oh, damn, I really like him. He don't got hoes." And blah blah. First of all, stop. Red flag. Why the fuck you ain't got no hoes? Exactly. Ooh. I don't what want you. What if I'm really you. into That's you, though? Real. It don't Ooh. matter why you... I didn't say you got to be entertaining these hoes, but why the fuck you, as a man, why don't you have hoes? You know, I don't know, want you a know nigga... Women. Women I don't different want a man that nobody man that has... Yeah, women love a nigga that you gets females. You got to have hoes to fuck with me. They do that. And I have... In, in just, reverse, like, I would crazy. expect a nigga nah. to want me to have admirers myself. But You don't want a bitch nobody wants? But no, that's my point, though, because it's like... And I've spoken on this before about men have to know how to handle a bad bitch. That's Facts. true. Niggas have to know. Niggas have a lot of insecurities. And I don't know how y'all deal with them. But my point is, yeah. Ooh, y'all, y'all also have to deal with those niggas that know how to get females. Exactly. As, as, long, as long as it's like that and it's not always that insecurity and all the Either. social media insecurity and stuff like that, and it's then it's a, cool. It's hard for to, me because... I ain't gonna lie. I done been. A, this is what you don't want to be as a female. You don't. You do not want to be a nigga's first bad bitch. Oh no, you don't. You want don't want to be a nigga's first bad bitch. Oh yes, be. you do. No, no, you don't. No, you don't. <laughs> Let like, everybody take a pause. Everybody that take a shot. He's not gonna, that, he he not gonna know what to do with it. He's not gonna know what to do with that. That too, and it's, it's just like the insecurities that come with it. And I fall victim to that because the, I, I'm trying to switch that around though. So if y'all out there and want me to be your first bad bitch, that shit dead. But I fall victim to it because not only am I a bad bitch, but I'm just cool as fuck, too. So I be just vibing with a nigga, and then all of a sudden you see, say if you do see some of his hoes, like they're lame-ass bitches. Like, oh, so really I'm your first bad bitch? Like, for real? <laughs> yeah, that's real. No, I, then I can't, I can't fuck with him. I'd rather fuck with a nigga that got bad bitches than got bad because you do this. Yeah. Can I be honest? I think y'all follow the wrong rules. And it no. misguides y'all. What well, do you the, mean? I mean the how, pro- you, how you mean say we follow the wrong rules? Kind of, I mean, I can tell you both how. And okay, the, go ahead. The proof's, the proof's in the pudding. Right? What's the pudding? Crickets? Silence? What, what's, what's the pudding? They're saying the proof's in the pudding, but ain't told us what the pudding consists of. I mean, of. what's it mean? Both of y'all isolated. Huh? What y'all doing ain't working. How, yeah. What that mean? What? what you mean isolated? Like single? That's not true. Yeah. That's we all crazy. single, though. Why? You're single, too, yeah. So many. So we don't got the answer, Sway, right? I got I opinion. We got strong opinions. I, I have a preference, and right. I know what I would, right? What I, I know what I would right now. That would lessen my. That's you kind know, of messed up. It's not messed up. I'm, I'm looking in the mirror when I talk. I'm you? not. I'm not just applying this to y'all. I'm, I'm including myself. Yeah. So what's your? So what's your like putting? Like what? Are well, you I'm about to ask you. To this, this is what I'm about to say. What like I don't fall into the same code of conduct. I I don't got hoes for, real. but but it's not because hoes don't hit me that's, up. That's true. It's true. I don't got hoes. But I said that you don't have to entertain them, but you have hoes. Right, but I'm. You don't want a nigga that ain't got no hoes. Ain't nobody even trying to fuck with you. What you mean you ain't got hoes though? I don't right. Got hoes. What, I'm, what I'm, you I'm, mean? I'm saying, what does that mean? You see, see how foreign it is to a whore. I'm just. <laughs> I'm just saying. I, I'm just saying. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't. I don't. have hoes for real. Like. What that mean? I don't. I don't entertain anybody. You don't entertain. Like them. the people That's that different. hit me up. If someone does slide in my DMs, I'm, I'm really not interested for real. Like, cause it's not. It's just not. Are we on her lying? That's no, what her it just do? came out. Though. Don't worry about it. I'm gonna just I let just that came one out. slide. <laughs> no, nah, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm not, I'm not lying though. I don't got hoes for real. Oh, it just came out live on episode yeah, three. <laughs> this is crap. But, 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 Chase. No, but no. they ain't gotta be in your DMs, cap. but that don't mean you don't have. It's hers. not cap. No, no, I was talking about my. No, no, no to talk Chase. to me. I feel like oh, right <laughs> I, feel like, I, I feel like oh, <laughs> mother <laughs> received a text message before this, and his overheard just trying to find clarity for his bitches. No, <laughs> no, no, I mean this, this yeah. is my man. First, no, this no, no, is my right. man. So, so whatever, oh, whatever O say, I'm agree with. No, no, not not fuck agreeing with me. Yeah, okay, hold on. No, lying so, together. Don't no, no, let stop, it happen. If they look at your phone right now, the last ten sex texts is no girls. 
I'm just asking. I'm not saying that. Come on, keep oh, it I'm just asking. If they looked in your phone right Kaylin now. Kaylin in my recent text. Well. But Kaylin. <laughs> <and, and, and, laughs> no, but but real shit, though. Why no, you, hold like, on, hold on. Why no, you look like that? Because the baby. I was a handsome white dude. I'm not saying you sh- you hollered at him. Y'all cool. But I'm saying, why you look like that? But once again, Kaylin. Because I didn't like the, um, the contacts no, that bitch attacked me. <laughs> he was referring because, to because, me. Because, because, because this is how, this how you mind fuck him. Kaylin, do you consider yourself a hoe of mine? No, definitely it's not. In, exactly. This is my fucking point. Okay. You a home girl, right? You my yeah, home girl. Friends. Okay, friends. But, okay. Besides Kaylin, yeah, the last ten you, texts is you're gonna see friends. But the point so I'm, I'm they, asking the, you though. Hold on. But what, the, okay. what if your friends are hoes? Why are you looking like that? You see all say these. Say what little, you want to say. Okay, you, but your friends are but hoes, about, hoes, Owen. Okay, so how many of so these friends have you fucked? Technically, you have hoes. No, what if I lead by example and and I'm the one person that holds my friends accountable? Also, okay, I would say he holds his friends accountable. I heard that. One second, sigh. One. Think real shit. When the sorry, when the last time you heard me go on a date or even talk or brag about a woman or I was excited about a woman or anything? Sigh like, or me? No, I, I'm asking okay. like for me. Ooh. And you know, you know, I tell you everything. When's the last time you ever even heard me? It's been a minute, bro. Yeah, I guess. Something like that. So I'm, I say but that. But you don't to take say, every hoe on a date though. A hoe is a hoe. Okay, all you right. treat a, a hoe like it's, a hoe and a lady like okay. a lady. So when the last time oh, you've been on a date I'm with just a lady? Saying, I'm just saying when, when when y'all finally meet a motherfucker that that is so locked in, he not even entertaining motherfuckers. He not he not entertaining women out here. Like Stop. you you're not really looking at it the right way. You you're not looking at it like oh he he really a solid motherfucker. For no, real. I look at you, I said at what like I said. He, he got to have something me, right? up for real. Something's fishy. I said like me. Okay, I'm this I'm on the same type of time you on. I got niggas that hit me up and want to go out and all this. Do you? So technically, I mm-hmm. have hoes, but technically, do I do I entertain them? No, that's what you're speaking on, like entertaining them. I'm yeah. just saying I don't want a nigga that don't even have mm-hmm. nobody even trying <laughs> to fuck with them. That's the nigga I don't. You don't want a nigga that ain't got no hoes. Period. He gonna too. And he, you don't want a nigga that's just entertaining he, every hoe too. Either. If you don't got, you saying he gonna be like too pressed over you type shit. No, I mean like you One just second. entertaining everybody <laughs> that's trying to entertain you. <laughs> <laughs> what happened in here? Why are you pointing? One second. One second. I just <laughs> Hey. That got hoes. They won't care if you're dating her or you're not. Hmm. Don't entertain them hoes, but you got hoes. They just want to know if you have somebody that looks as good as them or better than them. He already Tell knows. Me yeah. that somebody. Yeah. He knows. Don't yeah. nobody want somebody that nobody no old, wants. Niggas no old get women, bro. Niggas ain't yeah, but that's neither here nor there. Shit. But what is here and there? Nola. Oh shit. Mm. What what hey. are like what are like strip club do's and don'ts? Do's and don'ts? <laughs> do's and don'ts. Child. Okay, so how much what time are, we yeah, got? Yeah, what is like strip club <laughs> etiquette? Because as far as like the female. I was gonna say like the, the obvious thing to say is like don't be cheap or don't right? But it's like I feel like it's more there's a whole culture behind that scene in Atlanta. Like what as women, what are some things y'all notice? That you don't like, or the shit that just irks your fucking nerves, whether it's a motherfucker touching you or whatever. Like, what are the, what are the strip club the, the strip club dudes and those the etiquette? What's better, day shift okay. or night shift to you? Okay, so I got an answer for both of you guys. What's a better bag? I want to say mid shift for that answer. What the fuck is mid shift? Mid is between day and night, so oh. that way you get a little bit you. Um, you get a little bit of the day, like towards the end of the day, yeah. and then you get night, but towards the beginning of the night. So it's not all like slow and everything, like day, and it's not all crazy as fuck like night. It's like right there in the middle. What hey, is that tell noise? Buffalo to get that later. Um, so mid shift. For real? Yeah, the dude, like, man, the shit that you, what's so very irritating is like, I'm gonna speak on the dudes first, then the girls. Yeah. So strip clubs do and don't, right? Nah, g- give me this. Let's, 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 let's break it down. Do you even know what etiquette means? I'm not trying you. That's yes, I know crazy. what etiquette no, means. No. That was not the no, etiquette, right? You know, know what etiquette means, <laughs> motherfucker? Yeah, in a sentence. But she said, strip club etiquette is no, different from etiquette. etiquette. You said etiquette back like it was a spelling bee. I just like want to make sure that's the question okay. I was answering. All right, so I, I want to break something else down. Okay, so, break it down. Do you know what breakdown means? I do. I'm, I, I wasn't okay. trying you. I was just making sure. Spell it. Nah, for real, though. So... What's the worst customer and what's the best customer? Okay. In your opinion. All right, which one you want first? Give me the worst first. 
All right, the worst customer. What's the worst customer in the strip club to you? The worst customer is the one who does the most but does the least at the same fucking time. Mm. Meaning. Touching the shit but tipping the least. He's going to uh, fucking compliment you like all fucking night. Like, bitch, I have a. Sorry, but I have a fucking mirror and not to be cocky, but like, I know I look good. Even if y'all don't think I look good, I think I look good. So I don't need to hear that from you. I'm not here. I'm not. I don't come to work for, for fucking compliments. compliments. Unless he paying a lot, then it's cool. I mean, it still is it's it's, annoying, but at least it that. comes with some fucking money. Yo, take like, it. Huh. That's the worst type of customer to come up and be like, oh, I just I just wanted to tell you, I just think you're so beautiful and all this and that, and then walks off. Okay, so where's my fucking money at? Hold on. <laughs> hold on. What if you are pretty and he just came to eat? Well, then go over there and eat. You don't need to come over here and be nah, telling but, me I'm pretty. But I can see myself. I'm not saying I do that. I can see myself doing that. You just that. said you can see yourself doing nah, that. Nah, I'm just saying. If if, <laughs> if me and O went to, to the flame real quick to get them wings real quick, and I wasn't about to spend too much yet, maybe later I was, and you and you walk by, I might just be like, damn, shorty, gorgeous. like. Well, that's fine. Like a walk by. So you're going to diss me if, if right uh, in that moment I don't make a transaction? No, like a walk by is fine, but you got people that... Even sometimes, like, I've seen a lot of... I don't... Personally, me, I don't get on stage. But I've seen a lot of girls actually be on stage in the thick of, like, dancing, swinging, all that, for a guy to come up to them just to tell them, you're so pretty, and then walk away. It's like, you just stopped the whole motion to tell me that. It's a it's an etiquette. At least, like, wait till I get down or whatever. Then come, you know, feel me? <laughs> all right, that's the worst type of customer. <laughs> Hold on, so... Now, I don't want to be cliche on the best customer because clearly if a nigga go in there and throw 50 grand, yeah, you're going to say that. But I'm not, no, I, don't mean, not I don't mean like that. What What is considered the best customer in a strip club? The best type The regulars? Of somebody that you're used to getting? No. Or? I mean, it could be, but um, really, I think. You care how he look? The best. Don't care how he looks. Do you care how he looks? No. Don't, it don't matter. We care about how the worst motherfucker look. Because, nigga, you can't be ugly and <laughs> get annoying. Annoying. and annoying. Ugly you and gotta annoying. You got to pick a fucking struggle. Together. You dance <laughs> before, Kayla? Whopping? Have you ever danced? No. Oh, I'm just asking. Okay. Uh. So you got to pick a struggle. But uh, with the best customer, no, hell no, it don't matter. Like, the best customer is somebody that ain't bag. on no fucking weird shit. That's just cool. It might offer you a drink and shit. Y'all drink together. Might talk about some shit. Might <laughs> give you a little bread or whatever. It don't even got to be the one that's putting the most money. That's your best customer. Because them niggas be annoying, too. What are you talking about me? <laughs> that's yeah. a fact, though. You just, you best customer, nigga, I, I, just feel, cool, I feel like, like I feel like this is lost in the strip club. Cause what, what strip clubs have you danced? Top top three or five you've danced at in Atlanta? Top three for sure. I got a shout out Follies, RP Tour, bro. Oh yeah, RP Follies, man. Follies, what else? I love Follies. Um, Blue Flame. I'm gonna give it love to you. Love the Flame. Uh -huh. And then as of recently, Magic City. Okay, Magic. I, I, is okay, is Magic. this a lost art? I don't know how much a dance costs no more. I feel like girls just get to yeah. dancing and they just want you to keep going. But whatever, That's a great point, whatever bro. happened to like I used to be able to go to Stilettos on Merida Street and it was five dollars a dance. So every song mm -hmm. and DJ stop speeding the song up. Play Maybe it, speed. at, his Play it at his regular speed all the way through. No, that's how he get his tips. That's what I'm saying. Like... So if I if it, back in the day three <laughs> songs I used to them songs it used short. to cost me don't fifteen. Yeah. And, and if a club was ten dollars a dance for thirty dollars, I had you for three songs. This is, is that, a, this is that is gone? A good question. Because y'all be acting, y'all act so y'all don't even give me effort. I be if fair I don't though. Keep I be fair. With, like if I just go up to a nigga and I know damn well like I know the song, like I know the song from the golf, I'll be like we are gonna start on the next song. But I'll still like. Pre dance, how like much? Before the next song will <laughs> the come pre dance, pre dance pissed me off too because y'all don't be doing shit. Y'all kick one little leg up and no, put it right back let down. Me say this, how much is a dance? Give a fuck. How uh, much? It's different everywhere. Uh, it's at, different. at the flame, how much is it a dance? We ain't gonna do the flame. Just say, y'all like deleted that. the price of a dance. <laughs> we ain't gonna do the flame. Daddy like that. No, it's the home talking real shit. It's real shit though. It don't exist no more. Y'all don't show the same passion per dance. No, this is a great point because I realize this. You're not dance with every girl. How much is a dance at the Blue Flame? Tell me now. Home with a five dollar dance is at the Blue Flame. It ain't five dollars, bro. Fuck if no. I get if I give you five dollars <laughs> at the flame, you're not gonna, you're gonna give gonna me dance one song. All right, but the DJ then, is gonna definitely. So okay, hold on, hold on. Gonna, Let me DJ do the math. Fuck with hold you. on. Oh, what's five times twenty? A uh, hundred. Sure. So if I give you a hundred dollars, you gonna dance for two albums? A hundred dollars and do what? Don't no, no. I asked you a exactly. simple question. Next. It's five dollars a dance. Twenty yeah. songs. Hundred dollars. Can you? I mean, what? So I, I'll say there's half. there's been times there's <laughs> been times like it two right there's been They're times when I shit. have but it depends yeah. like if I'm up that night like you know what I'm saying niggas that bitches act funny like if if I'm up that night and I already got a bag I already got some money like I ain't stunning that little fucking five whatever but if it's fucking slow 
and I ain't got no fucking money, nigga. You, you say, gonna well, do how it. much running? I'm gonna dance but every if, but, last but if it's a bag in there, then you're not about to sit there by this nigga trying to nickel and dime each dance. It depends because just because a nigga only says like, oh, let me get one dance, you never know. Like when you dance, when they talk to a nigga, that one dance turn into let me get another one, <laughs> let me get another one, let me get five more. So you never know, or and vice versa. Like a nigga might have two thousand, and you go over there and he don't like your vibe. You might only get the one dance from him, and he's seeing you about your way. So mm. you really just don't never know. You just got to be cool. I'm gonna speak to multiple things. One. Y'all did delete the motherfucking price. <laughs> yo, because <laughs> I don't did. know about you. She just told let's, it. Yeah. Let's say I got a few hundred on me, right? Yeah, and then I, I took a few hundred out. When they get to dancing, I'm just sprinkling. Yeah. That's the. Do y'all like the sprinkle? favorite customer. Do y'all notice? <laughs> I love the sprinkle. Hold on, I got to ask Chase. this shit, though. Chase! Chase. Zoom, zoom in on this. Thing. Yo, I think, yo, oh, I think about this a lot, though. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, hold on. Because girls get away with that shit. Y'all don't even. Y'all, y'all give girls the same energy. If a girl's cheap, and the sprinkling slow, y'all, y'all dance, y'all all on her, showing her love. Uh, do y'all notice if a nigga is throwing his ones, if he's doing it slow? D- does that matter to do y'all? Do we notice? Like a slow sprinkle, because because I don't, I like my shit to, to last a little bit. Is that the question? Do we notice? Do you notice the slow sprinkle? Can we curse? Yes, yeah. we got a big curse. It's been the fuck? <laughs> Hell yes, we fucking notice, nigga. Does it matter? It fucking, yes, it matters. It matters. It matters a whole lot. Would you notice if, if a nigga sprinkle his ones, right? Say you dance, you turn this way. Do you sprinkle the one, but the one don't hit the floor, it land back on him. Do you mind if I take that same one and add it to my sprinkle, <laughs> which I do a I lot? I wouldn't say like, <laughs> yo, no, it's I real wouldn't. shit. Listen, this real, real shit, shit bro. I wouldn't say add shit. it back to like where you were sprinkling at, but I would say just like, Thud, have y'all ever noticed? No, a, have y'all it, ever noticed a nigga recycling his ones that landed back? Yeah, yeah. yeah. and I turn Don't around and I be like, that's embarrassing. You're not doing that, Nick. I, dance. I swear to God, if y'all, if but, I ever dance for y'all, whatever, comment below. Y'all know I did. But to, to, that, to that point, <laughs> also, like, let's say I got five hundred. You just said a dance was five dollars. Cap. But it's not five dollars, right? But so let's say I got five hundred and I throw five hundred in two seconds. <laughs> Thank you, bro. Gone. Yes. She gonna pick up and leave after that song. Yes. I don't. I stay. I chill. How long? How you Let know? Let me know. Can you, you start telling us? I mean, like Can I you said, start telling us. Okay. Well, this all go back to like I said earlier. It depends on how the night is going. If I'm already up, and and if you spend that five hundred, so I'm staying with you probably for the rest. If it's like two, I'm a, and we close at three, I'm gonna stay with you for the rest of the night because I already got my money. I just made a five hundred easy. I'm gonna stay with you the rest of the night. If it's slow as fuck. And I ain't made shit all fucking night, and it's down to the fucking wire. You threw that. I'm gonna I, stay a little I don't, bit. But I don't like how I don't go. like how it depends on how the club. But that's looking. how it is. Nah, nah, have, that's nah. How it is. But 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 if if I'm getting my if if I but, so if I was selling weed allegedly, I don't right. know. I don't do drugs. I don't deal with drugs, y'all. If I was allegedly selling drugs, it, it wouldn't my I wouldn't change nothing to how I'm getting off a three five or. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna give you a three four, which I used to like to do to girls a lot. So Sorry. That's, okay, no, Wait, that's damn, I don't do that. <laughs> but I'm saying, because <laughs> girls don't really check. But I wouldn't change nothing. Why does it always change? Why does that what matter? What you mean you wouldn't change nothing? Well, so you're saying if if you had a customer that was like, around. okay, I'm gonna give you a grand to drop off whatever a grand could get you. Is this up? cool? If you get five more so customers that night, you're not gonna go to the other five customers. You're just gonna be like, you nah, would, I got my little thousand, so I'ma just chill here. You would. Yeah, Think because... about it. No, that don't if make you sense. Okay, sold, if you sold, say you sold allegedly three pounds of fake weed, and CBD. you already <laughs> CBD. CBD. Fake. You already made your money for the night. So then, if you got somebody calling you for a fucking gram. You already in the house chilling. You got your money and shit. Is you really finna get up with the same excitement as you would get to a gram on a slow day when you ain't sold nothing? Excitement, no. excitement, no. But business wise, if he hit me for if if you hit me for a seven, mm-hmm. no, if you hit me for an ounce, let's say an ounce, mm-hmm. I'm I'm guessing y'all don't know nothing about drugs. If you hit me for a three five, and I'm about to give you this, you you already bought from me. You the ounce ain't hit me yet. I'm all my way to the three five to Decatur. But motherfucking somebody in Cherokee hit me for the ounce. I'm not gonna hit you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be like, oh nah, never mind, bro. Like I'm straight. Like and then come all the way around and give this nigga the ounce. Dancers do that shit all the time. Y'all energy changes. Like where? Like if I if he to his point, if I throw this 500 mad quick, you get to make the decision when you're gonna get up. You're not gonna literally count the song so I yeah. get my money's worth. Yeah. You might do like five songs and you might dip and I might lose soon. That's why I sprinkle slow. Cause I feel like you don't really know the math on how many songs was played. Bro, I got a crazy yeah. predicament I was in one time. Mm-hmm. Y'all remember like when V Live was over there on um Marietta V Live Marietta Street. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And before that it was Diamonds of Atlanta. Mm-hmm. Bro, I was in there one mm-hmm. night 
and I took out like more money than I wanted to spend mm -hmm. type <laughs> shit. This is back in the day. Mm -hmm. This is like 2014. I'm like 24 years old at this time. Right. right? It's like 10 years ago. Right. I, let's say I took out like whatever. Let's say I wanted to spend 200 and I took out like whatever, 500, 600, whatever. You did it at the strip club? Yeah. Idiot, but good. Well, yeah, I was new. All right, that's fine. I was new to the city. Go to the gas station I'll, across the street. Yeah. I was <laughs> new to the ATM for three dollars. Didn't go into the strip and club. And they take one. Stop side using of, the ATM stop. in the strip club, y'all. Sorry, strip clubs. I'm not hating. It's stupid. It's a gas station across every strip club. Take that and I go. I was fucking new to the I'm city. Sorry. All right, I'm sorry. I'm just putting you on game. Ten years ago. No, no. Let me tell you what happened to me. And this is why I fuck with y'all, but don't fuck with y'all. I took out. Let's say I had two to throw. I took out like five or six because I didn't want to be like, you know what I'm saying, on some cheap shit. I took it out. I had all the money in my hand, and it, I was in this little mini section at like the table. And this chick, she was kind of dancing over here. I kind of, I, I signaled, I signaled her over, like, mm -hmm. like yeah, shorty type. <laughs> she comes over. As I'm trying to separate the money to give her like a like to like sprinkle a hundred, she took all of my money out of my hand. Are you sweet? She, she took all of my money out of my hand. Oh, are you sweet? And went. Oh. <laughs> No. Threw it up herself. No. Ugh. Threw it all up herself. Oh no. And then threw ass for like a couple songs. And 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 the whole time this is happening, I'm looking at my homeboy like, you ain't do nothing <laughs> about it. See. I hope that's still not your that's homeboy. Funny, no, 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 no. What, 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 what the fuck am I do? Beat her up? Nah, nah. I, but I, no, I, I wouldn't have never let you take money. I feel like I feel like, like, I feel like something about your own. So fast. She bro. Could, but y'all so skilled. You got finesse. You know when somebody's so new and white. Yeah. You, to you to, to their credit, oh, it's like you, ain't you white and, and you new like, and you look no, green. I've been, I've been, yeah. At this time, I was in Atlanta yeah. less than a year. He was a lick, P. But we, you definitely could. He was a lick. No, I was a lick for sure. But I'm just saying, like, I literally, I got, I got, I got, I got the money, the rubber bands around it. I signal over. I'm taking the rubber band off. She grabbed all that shit. Like and she, tossed that shit in the air. Boom. And, but you know what's crazy? I swear on my mama, a stripper checked her. A, 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 another stripper peeped it and started going ham on her like that, like, like as like, if it was. Like, that's not cool. Like, yeah, like it was bad business. Another stripper started going ham on her, like, we don't fucking do that shit, da 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 mm. And she ended up, like, whatever, marched off. And I was mad, too, because she was bad as shit. But that happened to me. Don't. That wasn't. You wasn't with me. That shit would have not went. Oh, this is twenty four year old. That's old. insane. I would. I, I'm, I can't on, this, I'm on the side. That shit would have never happened. Where with like me. that wasn't cool. At least like she could have danced for you a little bit. Like even if she did, so like those. But not all of it. She was. But after the second song, I was so tight that she took all my shit and threw it. I didn't want so her did dancing she, for did me. Did she pick up or did she like? Once it hit the floor, he can't grab that. No, no, no. I can't hit it without getting beat Did she pick up or did the other girl pick up or did they have someone come pick up? Or you don't remember. I'm saying it don't matter. That's yeah, either, too late. That, that, that's too late, that's either here nor there. Yeah, Once it hits the ground, no, it's I'm a not dub. saying. No, yeah. do you get what I'm saying? I'm yeah. not saying that. He, I don't I'm saying that she coming like right, right. If she no. got the fuck on, who picked up for her? Right. You get what I'm no, saying? No, but it don't right. matter though. Because I did you tell her to pick up. I would have been like, pick up. He can't. I don't like it because I feel like you never know. Like this might have been his first time, but you don't know if this gonna be his last time. That might be his first time, but if you would have showed him a good time, whatever, he might be a regular. This. Man might come in here um, five times a month or whatever right. with the same money, whatever. So like, for you to just throw money now, he might not never want to come back right. to see you. And if he do, he don't want to fuck with you. And that was so the live. That was the live, right? Be live, bro. Yeah. yeah. Marietta Street. But, oh, see, back, back but, when oh, I think Tia owned yourself. that at the time. That's why we brothers now, bro. Tia was in there that God night, put me in your life for a reason, because that is shit. No, no, no. Nah, no, no funny shit. First of all, oh, you're not no bitch ass nigga, but no, you don't no. bother nobody. Right. But you are. One thing about O is he will avoid confrontation. He don't even yeah. get in confrontation. But but if you do, it's not it's not your cup of tea. Not saying I like it, but I don't fucking I don't mind. mind. Yeah, I it's, don't it's mind. like I, I and I and I feel like O, o like my, my man Sherb, I got friends that's like that's you like that. And then I feel like Thank you. I'm just waiting for a motherfucker to do that shit in front of me to O. Like we don't yeah, we don't so. we don't cause, cause you got your homies where you like, yo, this nigga really don't even want not saying he a bitch ass nigga, he not. He don't have to be tough either though. But oh, oh, you know we done we done been out and, yeah. and it, 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 oh don't get in this shit. But it's been like I, I could just tell a few times where some shit happened and it just rubbed me the wrong way. And I'm like, bro, I'm about to throw this nigga, bro. Yeah. Like, what you want me to do? And, and oh, it's like sigh, just relax. <laughs> it's not <laughs> that. Yeah. No, nah, where the fuck was we at one time? A nigga tried you on the boat. Was it a boat? We was yo so and over the summer we did like a boat party type shit and like God Lanier. Picasso. Huh? I mean, can nah, we be honest? My, my man, so well, well, let's nutshell this because I want to move on. But <laughs> one fucking second. One second. So, you keep putting your I feel like Kayla, was Kayla in it? Nah, nah, Kayla wasn't. Nah, nah, I ain't me Kayla yet. So 
Anyway, my man's AM like Visuals threw a party. He, he throws these real nice parties. It was a yacht party. It was at probably the, one of the top three funnest parties me and O ever been to. It was like a ratio of eight girls to one. Top two. And I was, and we was in there dominating for a meeting, all type of strangers. Going anyway, crazy. anyway, long story short, the, they were selling bottles. It was me, O, and Pac. It was just three of us, right? And so, um, he, O was the only motherfucker to buy a bottle. Like nobody, everybody was getting shots. Nobody bought a bottle from this bartender. And so, O, keep in mind, this nigga's beyond lit, worse than what he is right now. Like this nigga was like dancing to everything. Oh, O's was lit right now. Sorry, not sorry. But he was out of control, <laughs> lit though. Anyway, let's let's get to the point. Is some bum ass nigga, I, don't, I didn't even see him yet. O was so lit, he put his bottle down on the table, but nobody else had a bottle. And when he, it, the boat wasn't even packed yet. I guess at some point, the nigga takes the bottle and starts moving around with it like he was O. So I ain't <laughs> see it yet. So, so O come to me and was like, so I come here real quick. I'm like, what, bro? I'm having a good fucking time. Leave me the fuck alone, bro. You know what I'm saying? He like, yo, I think this motherfucker took my bottle. I was like, you think? I said, if you think he did it, nigga, let me go holler at him. <laughs> but as I'm trying to go holler at this nigga, I was like, sigh. Like, I, maybe I made a mistake. Just, just fuck it, bro. Just let it go, bro. I'm, I'm like, nah, bro. Like, that shit not about to slide. Like, I'm about to press this nigga. You know what I mean? So as O was convincing me not to do it, I do it anyway. You know what I mean? I'm like, fuck that shit, bro. I need that bottle back, nigga. So I go up to homie, and it turns into him allegedly like saying, oh, so I know you, bro. I fuck with you. I'm like, yeah, that's cool. You got my nigga bottle. He like, nah, man, I don't got his bottle, my nigga. You, you, you. He act like we was lying or something. He was like, I feel like your man making some shit. I'm like, bro, make it up or not, you didn't buy that bottle from that bartender. So I went to the bartender. The bartender was like, this, this broke ass nigga ain't buy shit. So pretty much the nigga took the bottle, bro, and was walking around with it. But I'm like, bro, I want to throw this nigga off this fucking ledge See, right now. See, and then real shit, my <laughs> logic kicking in, Picasso, I'm like, what, siphon and knock him the fuck out, throw, him in, throw him in the water. Facts. We, we going, the, the party ends, the, the boat people get alerted, they take the shit back to the dock. Why are we thinking about all Motherfuckers that? go to their cars and grab their shit, and now what's up? Now but we're not thinking about all that, Pete. Like a good time. No, no, no. But, but that, that's that's uh, what I'm thinking. I know you, he, he does do that. But, yeah, but, he he he. I, think, I, 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 I'm thinking. I'm like it's Atlanta, bro. We know Atlanta. what Atlanta's like. I, I'm not even. I'm, I'm like Sai gonna knock him out. He gonna get back to his car, grab his shit before no, he, he pull not. off. And now we in some shit. Now we in a shootout at Lake Lanier. Well, you live. There are a lot of black people. Right? Thank you. For, first of all, we was on a boat with our shit anyway. So that shit didn't but, even matter. But, but you know what happened? You know you know what happened? I grabbed another bottle. I love and we Chase. had a great fucking night. I, I get it, but why does he get to slide with that? Some, some things is worth getting to the next day. I get it. I get it. Six brothers are walking out tomorrow. We have liquor, hmm. naked women, and liquor, money. naked women, and money. Right? Don't touch the women. Don't touch the women. Spend as much money. That's a fact. It's a walking out tomorrow. That's a fact. Ooh. Yeah. And also, you know fact. what else fucks up? Is and I'm going to put this blame on men. We walk in there like it's real life. We we walk in like, like let's say I never met you, Nola, right? I walk in the club. Mm. I see Nola. I'm never once thinking this is her job. I want to pay her and get a dance. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I'm Some not. people do, though. No. Some people I'm talking do. about me. Oh, okay. I'm just, and it got I, I, before. I, I'm saying oh. I'm saying this is the problem with a lot of men. <laughs> no, because me, no, remember when you made the point of the dude that comes over to you and tells you how beautiful you look and he leaves? Mm -hmm. You wanna know why he does that? Because that's the same thing he does when he sees a chick at the mall. He not he not looking at you like you're there working. He he walking in there and see, and, and being like, damn, that's a badass woman right there. I'm finna walk over there. I, I'm kind of nervous. I'm kind of whatever. Yeah, I'm about to plant the seed, tell her how fine she is, leave, maybe spin the block, try and get her gram or her number. They don't give a but, fuck but, about but all that. that, 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 that We're not, look, we not yeah. looking at y'all like we at Pizza Hut trying to get a pizza. Yeah. We looking at y'all like, oh, this is a badass woman. I'm trying to get her number. I'm not trying to. I, I, I'm just saying for all the men who go in there and they don't pay for a dance or they, they're not spending money or whatever. They they looking at y'all like like they're walking out in a in a fucking outlet and they just happen to walk past you and they it ask could, for your number. It could be that fifty percent. The other fifty percent is they know where they are. They're aware of their surroundings. Meaning if they know they don't have the money, or whatever, that is the best thing for you to do is to walk by and say you're so beautiful and keep it pushing. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So True. avoid. So it's both ways. Like some don't look at it like that, but even those that do, if they can't provide it. 
they'll just leave you with that and then just keep. I and I don't mind that. So only mind like if you literally go or have me go out my way. If I'm way over here at the bar and you're way over there and you'd be like, "Come here," and I walk all the way the fuck over there, um, <laughs> just for you to say, wow. "I just wanted to tell you you're so pretty." Hey. Maybe I could have stayed at the bar for all that, <laughs> or you know, Facts. you could have. For me to go out my way. You ever got a boyfriend up there? That's my last question on that, too. Sorry. Hold on. No, no, no. I just want to know. <laughs> Have no. you ever Dude, found boom. your man at a, at, while you were dancing at the strip club? Have you ever, like, oh, I met this nigga here and he became my man? Yes and no. You have? Listen, yes and no. How? How no. the fuck is yes and no? <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you. So the answer, answer is yes, it's yes and no. Okay, why is it yes? It's yes, because um, I was at a strip club when I did meet a guy. We dated for about two years. You weren't I wasn't dancing? Working. Yeah, I wasn't working. Oh, so I did meet him at okay. the strip club. But uh, as far as like while I was dancing there, hell no. What? And this is just my opinion, I, and I could be wrong, ladies, but I don't think that a woman that's stripping, and I love the women that's hustling. Same with niggas that's, that's hustling. I feel like when women are dancing, they should not have boyfriends. Yeah, I agree. You even told me um, that one time. I think I, I called I, you was talking and, about and you, it. And you can do whatever the fuck you want. I feel like if your man is not a pimp, why are you dancing? And now, I, I, now, if, if you meet him in the in the strip club, if you're dancing and you meet him and y'all become boyfriend and girlfriend, you should stop dancing after that to me. But it's like right. if you're still dancing, how do you feel like you're in a relationship that could work? You're in you're in the game of hustling. I don't. You're in the game of finesse and niggas. So it's like, yeah. how have you ever seen a successful re relationship between a stripper and a nigga? That's not a pimp, no, and it actually unless, work out. Why do y'all do that? Why do, why do y'all think that y'all y'all should be savages? Y'all shouldn't be worrying about love is, at the like, end of the night. At, at, just like how men are very stupid in certain areas, so are women, and we are more emotional. And in the in the club, like it's hard already being people like even dudes like think a certain way about you, treating a certain way. So like sometimes when you do feel like you have a like a genuine connection with somebody, you kind of do fall victim to it because it's like, damn, he don't mind what I'm doing. He understands and this and that. But like, no, but that's at the end of the day, it never, it never, what? it never that's fucking not works. What's not? But it what? is what I, happens if, sometimes. If you're trying, like, him, thinking that a man is gonna understand what you're doing is not realistic. Right. So I, I don't because think because I feel like this is my theory. Though. I feel date. like if you wanna date someone that dances, you need to take them out of the club. Right, you need to be able to. Support. That's if my you fucking want, point. If you and have a, a problem with what she's doing, fake prom a lot of them support be them. like fake promising, like they be know, making fake promises. Sometimes, like just like say you, you just say like we're on our first date. Let me make you're not finna, you. yeah, bring yeah, me I'm, up. I'm listening. Say we're on our first date or whatever. Yeah. You're not um, immediately gonna be like, oh, uh, you want to pay bills and do all this stuff because we're just getting to know each other. Yeah, but eventually down the line, that's what you would want to do. So it's vice versa. Like in the club, when we first meet a nigga, we don't expect him to take me out the club the first fucking yeah, yeah, week yeah. or two weeks. You do they mean? use that but line that, that line, we hear about? Do they use that line? That, what saying that, like that, uh, on? no that that line like uh you don't you don't even have to you don't have to do this. Man, I hate that. Fucking is that a real line? Cancel that in 2024. <laughs> is y'all have shit. to do this a real line? It's a turn off. Do do niggas do that? They no. Where you think they got it from? Yes, it's a real thing. So they go in there and like, fall in love with you so much that they're gonna be they like, go, yes. you don't have to do this. You don't, you yes. don't have to do this. Yes, they, they literally say. <laughs> it's like the movie, like Brooklyn's Finest. You see Richard Gere fucking the prostitute, and he like, you ain't gotta do this no more. They real literally talk, do though. it. Wife her. But be the Damn. main one tricking. I just wanna yeah, say that. Well. Well, peace. Well, Thanks to all the strip club now. I appreciate shout it. Shout out to y'all. Love y'all. Where we at with it, oh? <laughs> hey, if your man, if you, let's say you're in a relationship. And Kaylin, right? answer this. Sir? Crank this, Kaylin. Kaylin, please pull your vagina out. Put it on the table. Yo. <laughs> Let me get that smack, drink. smack him live on camera. Let me Kaylin. get that drink, yo. <laughs> Put hands on this nigga, <laughs> Kaylin. <laughs> One second. But nah, for real shit. If you're in a relationship, right? Your man cheats on you, but, but you, but, but real shit. Your man cheats on you. Kaylin. You in love, though. Stupid love, like seeing green and shit. And y'all live together. Hmm. And y'all got a child. Do hmm. you leave them? Do you make it work for the child? Do you just ignore, like... I, do those, you cheat back? Do you cheat? Yeah, do you cheat back to get your get back and then keep my moving like nothing happened? No, don't. let's not do no, that. No, I'm being so realistic. My man does not have to cheat on me. If he does, no one has to which 99% of niggas I mean, do. cheating doesn't bother me. I'm not like... Okay, what do you mean? This is my theory. Break it down. I like that. Okay, I feel like cheating is when you're not honest about something. If I ask you a question and you answer it honestly, if I do, 
I might feel some type of way about it, but my mentality is much. If I'm with somebody, is is way more than just because I like them mm. or just because I love them. Facts, That's bro. bullshit to me. To me, I feel like if I'm fucking with you, it's because I see that we can make something bigger. You know mm. what I'm saying? So it's so much more. Than yeah, just but a nigga, sex. a nigga might still fuck that up, Kaylin. What? Fuck what up? Okay, yeah. that's cheating means that you was not honest, that you just didn't tell me what you did. Okay. So what if he I'm does that? What if he cheated? Okay. I'm not leaving you because you cheated. If I, like I said, if mm. I'm fucking with somebody, there's so many more reasons why I'm fucking with you. I'm not fuck. I'm not gonna leave you because you fuck someone else. Are you crazy? I so, like Kaylin. Hold on. But how, how many times can you get away with? No, no. I, no. I mean, at some point, it's you realistic just because a lot of I'm, girls do that. I'm a big believer. That. I'm a big believer. How many times, Kayla? Accepting people for who they are. So if if that's the point, mm. if that's who they are as a person, then cool. I'm gonna have to accept it at so, some point. If so, I want to be with okay. you and you're a fucking cheater, if you're a serial liar and I want to be with you, I'm gonna be with you because I want to be with you. Okay, okay. My my question um, to so that I is: Do you love unconditionally? Anymore. Yeah, practically. Right. So so in my in, in, in my in my opinion, if you're loving unconditionally. And he's not loving you unconditionally. Why stay? What do you mean he's not? But it's what do you mean he's not? Because he's lying or because he's yeah, cheating? Yeah, that means yeah, it's yeah, not unconditional. Yeah, yeah, that's not that's not unconditional. But so, how is so, it unconditional? Well, well, let, let, let's be Just honest. Just because he's fucking someone else doesn't mean he don't love me, and that doesn't mean he's he right, right. 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 okay, but, Talk but, that shit. That's not that shit. I'm, I'm, and I'm gonna tell you why. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna tell you why. We all, I can say I love you to all y'all. Y'all can say I love you right back to me, right? I love you. But we all don't. We all, we all are not capable of unconditional love. So a nigga might love you, but he might not love you more than he loves himself. And time out, hold on, one second. A nigga also might not even love himself the way he think he do. No, that's real. That's right. Who so cares? Uh, I, I do. <laughs> so so hold on, hold on. I'm, prime example is if a nigga, I don't know, if a nigga <laughs> smokes cigarettes and mm-hmm. he's supposed to know that that's damaging him, and in time he needs to make a commitment to himself. To stop doing that, and if mm-hmm. he doesn't do that, that's an that's an, that's a sign that he doesn't love himself. Mm-hmm. And so, if a man doesn't love himself, he can possibly ever I love you unconditionally. Love you. But that okay, yep. Yeah, but you're saying it's un, is not. And oh, acting like I'm not but saying that facts. Mean that, okay, you just I, saying, I get what you're, not, you're saying. You're not saying facts. You're just saying some gay shit. That ain't gay. It's real. He doesn't love I, himself. I, I, no, but, but the fuck I, does that mean? What are we talking I, I, about? I'm, I'm, so I agree lo- and disagree. It's keto. I'm, I'm I'm telling you what I mean by that. No, but you're saying that that's not unconditional love. Unconditional love. Like, okay, that's your definition of it. You know what I'm saying? This no. is how you're defining it just because he's Unconditional cheating. love. That doesn't mean I, he doesn't this, this, uncondi- I don't have my own right? definition there's, of there's unconditional different love. conditions. Maybe my conditions that's are different from the normal though. person. Yeah, but no. No. That's conditional. Can I be honest unconditional with you, Kevin? is I would, without... No. Under any yeah. circumstances, there's not a circumstance that you could say, "Oh, but if you do this, then no." That's called conditional. Unconditional is no matter what. What, right? Yeah, but, but I, I give Sai no, that wrong. credit. I give Sai that credit in in the sense that wrong. as soon as you start saying, "Well," If he, what if he cheat? That's when you start adding a nigga that cheats on you does not love you unconditionally. Exactly, because you what the Kalen? What the fuck, bro? He can love you how he know how to love. Right. Yeah, like if he a nigga that's out of shape. Okay, but this is the difference. uh, No, I'm saying if he a nigga that's out of shape. If he a nigga that's not doing like you could watch a nigga and see if he love his kids for real. This this is real real shit though. So. That's not loving you unconditionally, Kalen. Why? I need you to know that because it's not. Okay. He loving you met probably the way he love himself halfway. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And if you loving him unconditionally, a hundred percent. I mean, why, I wouldn't say. I, why okay, would you stay there? I'm just asking. I mean, because I, agree, cause cause, cause would, I said it's more than love would, to me. Man, it, I don't, more than love. It's more nah, than I don't love. Fuck nah, I'm not saying. Go ahead, go ahead, besides, go ahead, go ahead. No, 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 I'm listening. Go ahead. I'm besides sorry. being in a relationship, that's that's like secondary mm-hmm. to like a man that loves himself. Like you have rules for yourself. This ain't got nothing to do with your other partner. This just carries over. Mm-hmm. So certain things like you hold yourself to a standard. Like I don't feel like cheating is like a um unconditionary right. love because would you do that? Would you do these things to yourself or would you do these things to like your mom or to your kids or whatever? So but yet you would do it to this person. That's not real. I think to a to a certain extent. Yeah, to a certain extent. To a condition, not right. unconditional. To show respect to what Kaylin's talking about though, it's like what if your love for a motherfucker and what he brings to the table Trumps him being outside and cheating. 
Still there not unconditional. Nothing that's, oh, there's there's nothing but, but, that's but, now argue, but now we're arguing about a but, fucking okay, word. And yeah, a you're worried about a word. Because no, no, to me, no, 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 okay, no, let's listen. Can, can can that wasn't a question. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Can, but can, we, can we stop sucking unconditional's dick? I can't, right. bro, because I was raised on it. So okay, I can't. I mean, I'm sorry. I mean, I'm I sorry. was raised on it, too. No, no. I'm about to bang the gavel on you. I'm about to bang the gavel on you. I can't. You met my parents? You're not your parents. I didn't say I was, but I love that way, though. I love that way, though. I do it with my... Fuck out of here, nigga. I love that way. Fuck you, nigga. I love that way. I love unconditional, nigga. I treat my brothers like that. I treat my my, my brothers, my friends, my family, my kids. I love that way, bro. You know yeah. that. Right. I know. To what you name? I'm yes. telling you. I'm. But that's what else not the fuck out of my name. So. Women. I love unconditional because I'm capable of loving unconditional. That's why, nigga. Because I know what it looked like. I know, bro. If I right now, bro, I can get locked up at four or five in the morning. My mom go to sleep at six p.m. I could call her phone. She's going to answer that motherfucker, bro. She's going to get up. Go get my kids if I need to. My dad will come fix something immediately if I need it. My family, that, that's unconditional love. And it won't stop even if they're mad at me. Right. Because a lot of these motherfuckers, you say, a lot you. of motherfuckers, once you, you love a motherfucker and then the, you see them mad at you, you see them mad for the first time, they won't do the same shit. That's not unconditional love. Sure, but, but from the perspective of Kaylin, what if that role is reversed in the sense that She's the unconditional motherfucker. Regardless if a motherfucker cheat, if 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 the evens outweigh the odds, and Kaylin's saying she's still with it because the pros outweigh the cons, then we arguing about a word at the end of the day. So with that, and with that's that being why, said, that's why unconditional that, love is the top of the thing, but bro. Listen, with that being that's said, that's why it's the top of the, the peak. It's between, over money. Where is the line between unconditional and stupid? Where's the line between loyalty and being taken advantage of? I I hate to say How this. How loyal no, good can you question. be without being dumb for That's a the person? thing about unconditional love. There is no thin line. Right. There is no thin so line. Like saying, There's yeah, no thin it's not line. Conditioned, right. conditioned Do, be hold on. Stupid, Do right? y'all know the word in the Bible for unconditional love? Anybody here? You can't tell It's me. like nothing or nothing. Thank you. And, and none of y'all even it's, knew that because I take that word so serious, I've studied it. I've been taught that word. I got mm -hmm. told that that word is agape. A G A P E. It's the word in the Bible for unconditional love, and that shit that y'all describing is not that. Okay, but yet they, it's not that okay. because they never run into it. No, they probably have seen it from know, somebody. Maybe I not a man, somebody, but somebody yes, else. Yes, I, I mean, know so, mom, somebody has nigga, felt unconditional nigga, but love. I have been the yeah, worst but at I mean, times. Like she's still right. No, done. that's what I'm definitely saying. I, like you said, you was raised in it, so was I. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, that's not what I require. I'm not asking. Because you're, maybe you're I, the giver. I the can giver. respect. Right. So, 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 so to get to it is, and, and I can respect that honesty because what you're saying is you will be with a man that doesn't unconditionally love unconditionally love you and still tolerate what he is bringing to the table like O said. You're cool with that. I, and and I'm not mad at you being because you could do whatever right. you like. So is that what you're saying? You're cool with no, that's, that? That's not what I'm necessarily saying. Okay, I'm tell me what saying you're saying. I'm listening. I'm listening. Can't uncon like okay. If that's what it comes with, because okay, you never know what you're gonna get into it until you're in it. Am I correct? Or am correct. I correct. You could be married to someone for 20 years and then they end up cheating on you behind your back. But if you, you marry too fast, but yeah. What? No, that, there's no. What do you mean? Go ahead, Kayla. So that, that, at that, that point, does mm -hmm. that mean at that point when they start cheating? They don't unconditionally love you? No. Okay, but they, that, did they unconditionally love you at a point when they wasn't doing yes. all of that? Yes. Correct. So what I'm saying is, if I'm married to a motherfucker, I've got kids with him, right? Say my kids end up being 15 and the nigga outside cheating now. Yeah. Am I going to leave? No. If all my docs are in order, my, my plants are Do there, every, back? I grew, I grew these back? trees from the Do ground to the top. The real Do you Why am I leaving? Do you built fucking the, cheat the, back? Do you cheat back? I love Would Kaylin. I cheat back? Do you cheat back? Uh, no. All right, I, I, I get it. I'm not You're cheating willing, back. Hold on, hold on, hold on. One thing at a time. If we got to the point where this is One a thing discussion. Thing hold on, Kayla. <laughs> so so we already understand you're going to stay. I get to stay. Not right, necessarily. Cool. Hold on. Wait. Hold on. Not necessarily. Hold on. So you'll stay if he cheats and y'all got y'all shit solid. Okay. I'll stay under conditions. What I'm asking is, you stay. You know this nigga that cheated on you three times. You stay. You at work. It's a flying, good-looking no, man. Let me ask the question. Okay, go ahead. It's a nice, good-looking man. 
Yeah. At this job, he, he mad nice to you, open the door for you. You might got a, a big box of shit every day. Sometimes he might, hold on, Kayla, I got this. A woman shouldn't even be holding this. It's and he's doing, it. hold on. <laughs> and, 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 hold on, hold on. And the nigga at home, he not doing little shit like this. He, he don't even open doors no more because he feel like he already got you. <laughs> hold on. This, this nigga is being mad nice to you. He noticed one day you had a fucking fish fillet. And so the next day, he, he buys me a fish He fucking around and gets you longhorn, something nice. Roof Chris real quick. Like, you know what? I'm not even hollering at you. I just want to make sure you eat something nice. I don't want you digesting this that shit into your mind. No, this, yes, you know your man cheated. This is another nice guy at the job. You know what I mean? He mad cool, always respects you. Don't even shoot his shot. He just mad cool. Y'all mad cool. One day you just, Dead. would you cheat back with that man eventually? It depends. That's a yes. No, that's not a yes. It depends. You depending is already cheating. Dependent, it was ever my question, bitch, my bitch depending is already depend. cheating. No, it depends. Cause why is, why cause is to it? to me, I'm an honest, on, if I'm a cheat, I'm an honest cheater. Depend on what though? I said, I'm an honest cheater. You gonna tell him you cheated back? What the fuck is an honest cheater, yo? An honest cheater is, listen, an honest cheater is... But not for attention. Not just because a nigga showed me attention. You gotta be deeper than that. Right, that's what I'm saying. You gotta realize that you're in a vulnerable state and you're not being treated. The fuck are y'all talking about? How you're supposed (laughs) to be treated. So just because a nigga at your job showing you attention, like, you shouldn't just go for that. Like, now, what do you do something else? Like... Cool, but like, Are you cheating back or no? No, y'all I'm give, leaving. Y'all give Me, these, I'm leaving. Oh, so you out of there? I'm leaving. First cheat or second cheat? Y'all got a kid so, together. Y'all live together. So he's paying the bills. For me, it depends. It depends he's on. He's paying the bills um, and the dick depends. vicious. I don't give a fuck. I don't had all of that. Okay. What, what I care about is the level of hey, disrespect gang. that came with the cheating. It's the level of disrespect that came with it. How did you do it? When did you? How long did you? I mean, time. Did you bend on this bitch? Did you just meet this bitch? Or was it just a one night stand? Do you care if, it, well, if he, it, it, everything if is he like cheats on you with a white girl? Does it sting more? No. <laughs> oh, okay. No, 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 no. No, it don't matter. No. Oh, okay. Cheating, cheating, cheating. Now cheating. I'll be honest. Like it used to, but that's just because of how because of how I was raised. Like and mm. you know, being like where where when I first came from New Orleans to. Uh, Georgia. I was in Fayetteville, Georgia. So. Nola. It makes sense now. Exactly. Hello. Dun, 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 dun. So when Tighten I first came here, um, I don't know what's Glyph going on. The mic's it. fine. The mic's fine. Who ain't cracked this motherfucker? It's a tip. It's a tip mic. Yeah, because it keeps falling down. Nah, it ain't gonna fall no more. Don't worry about it. <laughs> we lit now. Boom. Are right, we in there? Brim. So when I first came here, it was a kind of a cultural shock for me too, as well, because coming from New Orleans, it's like all black people, and then coming here, I was the only black person in my room. And even the black guys was liking like white women. So at that time, it did sting. But like as getting older, when you grow into yourself, like you start not to give a fuck about none of that. Like I don't have to be your cup of motherfucking tea or whatever the fuck you drink. I just want to say that shit don't bother me. Cheating is cheating regardless. It don't I just want to say the grip in the left hand that Nola has on the mug I'm and not the vape this drink at the fall. same time <laughs> is <laughs> fucking impressive. <laughs> like not like the balance you, you in the you mug with the vape with the bananas. Yeah, you can. <laughs> just didn't have to, I'm right. sorry. I was a one I was, y'all, y'all gave one me second. y'all gave me some one game though. <laughs> Kaylin, your, 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 your perspective <laughs> Yo, though, Kaylin, her, her perspective is real though. Kaylin's perspective is whether, mad real. Whether, whether, whether we dis whether we agree or disagree, Kaylin, I don't disagree. With I feel like your perspective is how a lot of women do. Kaylin's, and Kaylin's realistic. No, no, no. But but I still wanted to let it you. I want reality. I want I want to let everybody reality, know babe. that I'm leaving. I want to let everybody know that unconditional love. Is that shit special? And, I, and 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 I see you was getting bored at it, and I'm sorry you feel like that about unconditional love, but and and and, and I'm just giving women game because I know a lot of women don't do this. As y'all talk to niggas with potential, is a lot of women don't even test men to see if he gonna be, ever be able to commit to you or have that mental strength to be solid with a female and himself. And so I just I want y'all to start taking y'all time to see is he capable of unconditionally loving his family and himself. Before mm-hmm. he get to you, don't make that face because I'm I'm being honest. Right, right. And 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 Kaylin, it's small shit because you're not going like you saying, a nigga, you, you said oh, a nigga could, uh, could cheat on you twenty years after marriage. Listen, if you took your time and you was talking to a nigga and and stopped trying to date these niggas after thirty business days and, and just said, I'm not saying you, I'm saying women in general, women in general, if you like a nigga after thirty days a lot and he's ready to be your girlfriend, you'll do it. Majority women will do it. They will. They, they're not gonna waste time. They're gonna do it. What I'm saying is. Be a little bit, a little bit more patient, and just watch his habits. See him with his kids, see him with his family. See, see how he treat his moms. See if his dad did ha- partake in his life. I'm serious. Okay. See if he got. First of all, if he has an illegal hustle, if he has a clean hustle, if he's a, you know what I mean. Like these things matter. Does he work out? Like is he is he getting out of shape? Is he is he does he have the mental strength to go work out and burn that off? You know, I'm I'm serious. Does he fast? Does he hike? Does he pray? 
Does he believe in God? Like, y'all got to start seeing some of these things. I don't like how he feel like he got preached to me. <laughs> I'm, no, see, I, no, 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 no. That's like, the shit right there, though. It's, it's, it's in, That's the shit right there, though. Because no, 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 when you gave me your game... No, me. fuck all that. Because when, <laughs> when you gave me your no, game, I said I appreciate things. your perspective. I, I appreciate your perspective, But if I say something... Too. But if I say something to put you on game... No, I know, but, I'm cause you, no, but listen, this Because you ain't got a man right now like I ain't got a female right now. No, but this is the thing about Sai. Sai... Is his always preaching to people, right? But he never knows no one's background. I have an amazing, God fearing, I'm always preaching loving, to people. unconditionally loving. I got a father. lot of game. I'm an OG for real. And I'm not saying you don't. So, so you never but, learned nothing from me. What you know? I've learned things from you. Yeah. All right correct. then. So why I gotta be but, preaching? But, but I'm saying sometimes I be feeling like you be you be preaching. Nah, but if a motherfucker and, if a motherfucker putting you on game, he not. How always, I'm preaching? No, I know thing. I'm not saying. How I'm preaching if most women don't do that? Most but women don't know to do that. No. But most women don't know nice that. And got but most men, women, we be ready women to talk to niggas yeah. that have kids and they ain't even met their kids and then end up being their boyfriend. Or their baby yeah, mama, because their baby mama will tell you a lot. You don't even know Every if they, mama ain't you don't even know if he's fucking his baby moms. Him. You don't know how he treat his kids. You don't know nothing. But, on but that. you're sleeping with that same nigga unprotected, though. But on so a, that's preaching? Or am, I, or am I giving you game and you don't want that? I'm not saying game 101. Yeah, I, I, the tone is irrelevant. The tone is irrelevant. The tone. The tone is irrelevant. The tone is irrelevant. Put the sensitivity to hey, the side. But to that point, yeah, the tone is irrelevant. On the Sorry, subject, the tone, the tone irrelevant. Yeah, the tone is irrelevant. Okay. It don't matter how you to give me game. <laughs> I if you're giving, yelling. I said it calm If as you're hell. giving me game, okay. you're giving me game. It don't matter if you're yelling or talking to me calmly. Game is game. The tone is irrelevant. It don't matter. Nola like that thug shit though, so she's not gonna trip. <laughs> she mad rugged. It's when I text something to someone. You tone. depending on what you think I'm saying and how I'm saying it. It is to a certain extent, yeah. but it depends on if you're really if you're if you're having a conversation or are you really here to really listen? Because if you do, i there's been times when I'm like, damn, you ain't gotta speak like that. But there's been times yeah. when I'm really asking for advice and I don't even care how you speak because I'm I'm trying to hear what the fuck you're saying. Yeah, saying. So if you're you really trying to get this game or not, or are you worried right. about how I'm speaking that's to true, you, that's it's true. irrelevant. But, but tone does matter if you don't if you're not listening, if you're listening, the tone is irrelevant. So understand that you are the percentage of a small percentage of people that listen. Understood. People, black, black, and, black men and black women, white men. <laughs> don't, don't matter. If I'm mad, if I'm mad at a nigga, and I'd be like, nigga, what yeah, the fuck is wrong yeah, with you? I, I love you, fuck. nigga. I don't give a fuck. Does it matter how I'm saying it? Does it matter what I'm yeah, saying? I'm telling fuck. you, I I'm love not, you. If I don't I'm call, call you, you, out you out your name, better. If I don't call you out your you name and say bitch, or to me, or no, I'm just saying, watch your fucking mouth. I'm just saying, if I don't violate, I'm an alpha If you're not listening, that means you're you're listening more to my tone than what the fuck I'm saying. That means you ain't even fucking listening. Even 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 as a man, a nigga gonna talk straightforward. So you're going to take it how you take it. You know what I mean? What I'm saying on the subject of being unconditional and what comes with that, what about shit like threesomes? How, how, like, Are there I'm saying, no, I'm saying, I'm saying, <laughs> nigga, with, nigga, casa, nigga with from Cash Up to Olive Oil. Nah, I'm about to tell you. Are you talking about in a marriage? No, 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 no. What are you talking about? I'm, I'm about to tell you. Okay, let's if get it. you would shut the fuck up. You ain't got punch. I'm saying. <laughs> I'm yeah. saying, see, I know how my mic can get moved now. I seen it in yeah. three, in 4K. That shit would lose that verse though. It still is. Yeah. No, but listen. So we talk. We talking about unconditionality. Is that a word? <laughs> unconditionality. Unconditional. Unco being unconditional, cheating, right? Yeah. I'm saying, but when a man comes to you and and wants to bring another woman into the dynamic in a threesome, mm -hmm. what what are the rules on that? Like, who picks the girl? How how does that happen? And how, and how does that also not affect y'all or piss y'all off? What? The same way What's she the maybe does. What are the rules of a threesome? Yeah. Nobody says the rules of a threesome. Got, That'd be rules. the problem. I don't got rules. But 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 before you tell me your rules, Kaylin, I don't ever remember having a threesome with a female, and I don't have a handful, more than a handful. Huh. I I I, what I'm saying is, have you ever said, hey, before we do this, these are the rules? I feel like they don't do that. Gotta I do. Beforehand. I do. Gotta be beforehand. But a lot of people don't do that, though. I think before a guy even brings it up, because it's wicked because it's like, damn, you know? I think if you bring it up in the beginning of a relationship... What's it? What are the rules of a threesome? Damn, But you let know? me say this first before I get into it. It's okay. real quick. I'm not about before we now. even get deeply involved, I'm going to let yeah. you know up front that I'm into that type of thing. So that way when it comes up, Threesomes? you're not... Yeah, that way okay. when it comes up, you're not like taking it back because that's going to play a big part in it because now you feel okay. like, damn, I'm not enough or this or that versus right. if I told you in the beginning and then now it comes up, you're like... 
Okay. You're what nigga would say he's not enough? But we, that's crazy. You picking Female. a girl? Are you picking a girl? I'm, I'm picking the girl. Every time? Every no, time? No, I wouldn't. I mean, a nigga could bring the girl? If I got to see what type of taste yeah, my nigga. Like I'm going to be honest. The first Wait, time, man. you got to pick the nigga. I mean, if you got to. Well, sir? <laughs> she with that train. Wait, what, what the fuck? Wait, what? Yo, I'm going to wreck. Hey. Wait, what, what happened? <laughs> Chill. God. What did I miss? <laughs> no, it's because you just said nigga she last. She said you picked the nigga. It was still in my. Because I call females niggas because I'm a. Oh, is that why? No. No. I'd be like, what's up, nigga? You say we pull Or, like, or up, Nola, nigga? where you trying it's to get that? It's two dudes a threesome? Choo, 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 choo. Look, can we just It's two say, dudes a threesome? Sorry, let me say no. something. I'm just asking a question, man. Ty said, don't okay. say anything that I'm going to regret <laughs> on here or not regret. But either way, that wasn't any real, real advice. Because it's like, so which one did I do? Say, I'm going to be dead fucking honest. Uh, I, I don't give a fuck. I hate um, when people say, I don't give a fuck. Eventually, at some point in time. Choo choo. She fucked if up. that's what it is. No, up, it's man. not. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> you my nigga, yo. Yeah. Won't no, be me. But um well, like well, I said, it won't be yet. you, but you'll be the one that's okay. getting cheated on right, by your man back. and you doesn't care. It. Y'all were saying but that. Y'all were saying that. Y'all were saying that. Y'all were saying that. Y'all were saying that. Y'all don't have to pick the girl. No. I do I want like to that. pick it. I want to see. I want. I, like I want that. you to be the first picked up. The very first time I want you to pick because I want to see where your head is at. What if like, you, am what I your first what bad if you pick a girl? Really he already like? knocked down. I knew that was going. Uh, he, no, nah, it's not going. What we, if we he pick? Doing, what doing, if he pick a girl? He already knocked down. We y'all doing should be all picking new a girl. We doing all new bitches. All new bitches. So then why aren't y'all going to back the female? It works better that way. What happened? It is. It's better that way when y'all do it though. The woman but should me, go get the woman I for the mean, threesome. That's 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 cool. But Sometimes, but the nigga might care. have better taste than me. Sometimes you never know. I might be looking at care. this bitch and he might be like, damn. Nah, yeah, but that's backwards her, though, because because most niggas going is going to be down anyway. What it's more, it's a, a nigga don't care. It's a bitch. better, it's a better percentage chance of it working if y'all pick the girl and he just go, yeah, babe, I like what you like. Then you yeah. picking the girl. I mean, to him picking a girl, and you might, I don't really like that, babe. I'm straight it on that. But the thing is, if, if I'm the type of girl, I like what my man like. If you like what? it, I love I mean, it. Uh, babe, one one at a time. Hey, my man no. would know what I like. If you... Your man know what you like? Yeah, you should know what I like. Come on, I'm man. I'm the type, if you Yo, like it, I love that's it. Not, y'all do that shit with food. I know what you like, but you still might not want that right now. Don't do that. Y'all mad picky. Why yeah. not just don't do that? Don't just act. Don't act like y'all not indecisive. It might change your mind. Oh, I don't want sl- I I want flat skin today. I want a brown skin hey, joint today. Okay, no, but I y'all told come on, man. Y'all do too if much. I, so do y'all say, just pick. If you say you want to have a threesome, and I say okay, let's have a threesome, you should know what I like. Go get All what right, I so like. guess what? You my shorty. He ain't thinking about you. He nah, thinking nah, about nah, what you nah, like nah, when nah. you going out. She just <laughs> fucked up because no, we about to play hide and seek. All right? A, a little bit of blindfold. So now this is what we're doing, baby. We're going to be sponsored. We're going to have a surprise party. I don't know if you had this before. So we're going to go in the room. We're going to hit the lights. I'm going to blindfold you. I'm going to handcuff you. I'm going hand, I'm I'm to blind. I have your consent I'm on not, this, right? What? You're my, my shorty. I'm picking, I'm picking a girl. Like Hold on. One thing at a time. You don't know you like it yet. I'm going to blindfold you. I'm going to handcuff you. I'm going to bring the girl that I chose because I already know what you like, and you're just going to do this. We're going to run a triangle offense. You cool with that? I'm down. I'm not that. getting blindfolded. I trust you. If you're my man, like I trust you. I got too many like, fucking rules. You, you obviously got a good rules. taste if you with me, so like, right. can't so, be too far so, off. So can I just bring whoever either, and like, hit the, hit the yeah, and we just do, do what that. we do? I cool? Say, yeah. Me, yes. I it's would a green light? It. Yeah. Okay, so I would do it. Y'all niggas is crazy. I would trust you. If you're my man, like, if I'm even doing that with you, because that comes with, like, Certain levels of intimacy. You're not okay. doing it with a nigga. If you and mad. you and your man having sex un- unprotected, mm-hmm. right? This is a hypothetical situation, right? Y'all having sex unprotected. Y'all about to have a threesome with this new woman. When the threesome starts, is he throwing on a rubber or y'all just risking it and then it's just what it is? Uh, we risking it. Well, I'm not risking shit. <laughs> Yo, so <laughs> I gotta put a rubber on my shorty. Um, we risking it? No, you're not putting a rubber niggas, on me. But niggas die every day. So now I gotta put a rubber on me with my shorty. <laughs> No, you're not rubbering for me. No, you're just not. You're not rubbering. rubbering. So, 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 if I hit Shorty in the threesome, I throw the rub on. Then when it's time for you, I take it off and. I yeah. feel like that's gonna throw off the motion. I'm like, saying y'all gonna make my y'all gonna, gonna make my shit go soft, man. Like, oh, like, just, let's go. Like, this shit ain't gonna last all night it, now. It, it, shit, yeah, that's why you don't. That's why you don't do threesomes with people you don't know. I'm not doing that. Well, they're mostly all with people like you don't know. But for me, like it's a certain no. echelon. Like you no, can I mean, tell. You can. No, we gotta get these rules up. I mean, I'm not going to find out everything. Listen, I'm not going on the side of the street and picking a bitch. I'm going. We're going to the nicest of the nice place. We're going to like you can tell how somebody like carries themselves, and you still could be wrong. Not necessarily. You can still. 
could be wrong. Not but it's a less chance. Oh, she just looks clean. It's a yeah, less, girl, I'm not doing it's that. A less <laughs> chance, though. <laughs> yeah, okay, okay. Eight okay. times out of ten versus yeah, yeah. four out of, you know so what I'm saying? So limit, like, limit, a, limit the risk and then fuck fu- it. Then fuck it. <laughs> Got it. No, okay. Hitting the gas. And if I like we're wrong, so I guess your fault. Because why the fuck did you even want to fuck that other bitch not. anyways? I'm saying, but Kaylin, Kaylin, but what if you eating her pussy? You're not going to wrap that I'm up. Not, you're going, first of all, you're I'm going not back and no put on a fucking I'm dental I'm not doing dam. that to no bitch that I do not know. You got me fucked up. Okay, so you know her. If I know can her? We, can we all, can we, do we all go unprotected or protected then? If I know her? Yeah, Noah. If, like I, know her? From, no, if I know her? Yeah, Noah. Like, all right. Run it. Is that a bar? You might know her, but you don't know what the fuck. You might know her, but you don't know what the fuck she be doing. So it's just, it's still really you know what the same. I'm saying? You might know All her, right. but you don't know who the, what the fuck okay. she be fucking what be doing. What I'm saying is, <laughs> Tommy, will you? Are you doing it? Oh, My, bear, bear I'm whole risking it. Oh, bear whole threesome. It. We risky. We risky, but also, Tommy, will you? Don't like, whisper to me. Okay. But go ahead. Okay, Stop doing that. Talk. Doing it. I'm gonna talk with my just cock. Use your regular tone. One second, Nola. <laughs> oh uh, hell no. No, but listen, I'm saying. <laughs> My threesome might sound lame, mm-hmm. Uh-oh. but it's how like, many you had one before? Yeah. Okay. But I'm saying, yeah. I like I'm a big like head guy for real. So the, so the, I'm saying so the extra joint, mm-hmm. I really just need her to like just suck, take Not turns for- sucking with my shorty, mm-hmm. right? And then when my shorty start like riding or I'm fucking, mm-hmm. like you know what I'm saying, attend to the to the, the balls. balls. You know what I'm saying? But I don't need to double. I don't need to penetrate both of them in the threesome. That's fine. This nigga threesome nah, is doodle. you're penetrating. That's fine, though. Your shorty want to see you fuck a shorty. Oh, you ain't had enough of these. Sometimes <laughs> not, because what if your shorty oh. just don't like to suck dick? Oh. She oh. might bring somebody in that your likes to do what she don't like you. to do. Bro, you never... You what, never about, what about what I want? It's not about no, you. No, that's not what sex is about <laughs> all the time, though. It is for me. Oh, oh, please, ladies, don't take... Please forgive him. No, oh, you, you, you yo, your shorty want to see you... Fuck shorty for her. She might like. She might want to look you in the eye. That shit might get you crazy, right? I'm giving. I'm giving you. Am, am I, I s- preaching, Kaylin? I'm sorry. I, I don't want to preach. I don't want to give too much game. And Kaylin, you know what I'm saying? Like I don't want to preach. Oh, side note, bro. And if I gotta set this up for you, we will in the future. Huh? You cool with that? Can I set you up a threesome, bro? We're talking. And we talk about it we're later. Talking about it. All right, cool. Yeah. Do I have your consent we're to talking, set you up a threesome? We're talking about it. All right, bro. Okay. Your shorty's gonna want to see you do that. She gonna want to see you do that. that, that that's not yeah. even a good solid threesome for her. You should be running a triangle offense. You know what that is? Yeah, Phil Jackson. Not in basketball. Oh. Y'all know what the triangle offense is? Triangle what? Triangle offense. So it's like a it's a triangle, right? Mm-hmm. So 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 a sh- so a, so a nigga could be on his back, a chick could be riding him, and the other chick could be sitting on his face and they kissing. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. Or cool. or a, sh- a nigga could be hitting a shorty missionary. And then the other chick is sitting, sitting on, on her face. face and kissing him. Yeah, oh, that's cool. And, and y'all could do that any any type of way. I call it the triangle offense. That's my shit for real. I trademark that. You know what I mean? But anyway, another question on n- n- another question on the threesome. Yeah. Kaylin's texting her man. I'm texting my homegirl D. Okay. What's up, D? Yo, What's up, D? let me let me let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. In the threesome D? with your nigga, when the threesome starts, does he have to start with you? No, you gotta no. finish with me. You not nothing. No. Okay, I like, I like it. Okay. It can start wherever. It can start, it can start wherever. If, wherever but, in the middle, but, whatever. Okay, you to that end point. Up with me. What if like I'm trying to nut on both of y'all for real? Like both of y'all. You still gotta end your nut. Both y'all face. Both of y'all, y'all, face. Both of y'all yeah. faces is right here. No nut is going on my face. Why am I taking too far? I don't like not nowhere near me. What are we doing here? Where should it be? Not anywhere. Where should it be? In her. In. Not in. No mouth? I don't not like in that. the mouth? I don't like fluids. So no nut in oh, the so mouth on the mouth. Like you is not nothing in my mouth. So even oh. in like a threesome, like you're not fucking the other girl at all. You're, y'all not I didn't. No, no, no. That's different. That's I, fluid. I, I can't like nut on you or, or in oh. you or on you or with you or... On nothing. the butt? Not on the butt? I mean, I guess on the butt. I don't know, but I don't like nothing. You don't like fluid? I don't like nut. Damn. <laughs> no one is not in on my face, nothing. You're not doing that to me. Damn. Maybe, right. maybe, maybe my, my, okay, my husband or maybe. some shit, but I'm not. We gotta make okay, husband. Okay. Gotta be a husband. With, me? With another that allowed. With another that allowed that. It's allowed anywhere. It's just. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mess with this shit. No, no with this shit, bro. I love a, how different y'all are. That's allowed not. anywhere. It's just, I just would, if, like, if you're my man, not if you just, like, nigga, like, we both, like, it, at that point, it's up to you. But if you're, like, my man, 
Definitely. Yeah, I don't, it doesn't matter where it ends up, but I think it has to end with me. Like, right before you nut, like, I got to be the last thing <laughs> you was fucking with beforehand. I'll or fuck I'm going to be that. like, no. Like, All right, I don't like another that. question. In the threesome, yeah. y'all have a great threesome. Great night. Y'all went out, drinks, came back, threesome. Does she have to leave? Or is she allowed yeah, to she lay and has, spend the night till the morning? It vibes off. Right, Do she got? Because a lot of girls claim, oh, she's got to go right after, which there is fucking don't. stupid to me. It depends what the vibe is. Okay, though. so I'm, I'm going to let O get his thing because I got a question to segue off that, but go ahead. I was going to say, let's say she stays the night. There we go. Mm. Give it to me, O. Oh, pause. Oh, boy. I, I already know I, what the I, fuck I, 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 know what I, 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 Are you thinking what I'm thinking? If I wake up and y'all fucking, it's fucking over with. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, if I wake up and he want to motherfuck around too and wake up and he fucking this bitch, I'm going to. Without you involved? I'm saying, but, but, but. Picasso? Picasso? No, that's no, different. Thumbs up with thumbs Picasso down. Chase. I mean, okay, but... Hey! <laughs> We're slapping dicks okay. and bumping meats. Everybody Shit. bear with me. Listen. I'm saying is, maybe I tried waking you up. I cuddled next to the bosom. I put the soft, and then it got a wrecked dick on your ass in the morning. The flop Drake, and then it woke up like... Flop Drake. Nothing was the same, and it's flop not. Drake. All right? <laughs> that nigga said he gave it a flop Drake. <laughs> but listen, hold on. Nah, right? I, I, gave, I gave you a... <laughs> hey, hey, hey. I gave hey, you... Picasso, you asked for nicknames, nigga. Hold on. I gave you... I gave you the nothing was the same. <laughs> and now you got to fucking take care. Okay? <laughs> all right? Because if not, it's for true. all the dogs at the end of the day. Oh, but shit. listen to me. That's so that was perfect. Hard. That was perfect. But listen. Oh shit. But listen. I give oh, and, and and you fucking sleepy. All right. You you <laughs> fucking drooling on the pillowcase and shit. Yeah. No. And the, and the other joint who was plus one wake up. Let me all tell right? you a lot of stories. And she's sucking the soul out of me. Is that cool? No, but I'm gonna tell you a story there. Tell me if this is a, okay. Say so once. Um, no story. That's no. I gotta okay. pee so bad. Can we cut this? My best no, friend. No, no, we're not cutting. Nah, come go back. pee. You'll she be back. Be. Can you just cut me back? No, we'll just double team Kayla while you're going. Don't worry about it. Not, 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 not sexually. Just <laughs> double team right. like me and O versus we're Kayla. Come on. Hold on. Owen, oh, can you? I'll, one I'll, sec. I'll, I'll you one sec. <laughs> yeah, all right, I'm out. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> All right, I want to thank everybody for tapping into the Sorry Not Sorry show. We need y'all to like, comment, and subscribe now, please. All right, check out the official website, thesorrynotsorryshow.com. You want them to subscribe to your daddy, yeah? You want them to... Kaylin. Kaylin. Hey, right back. Scrape. Tell me the story. Not the slur. I don't know what they're going to tell you. Are we back? Should I tell the story, Destiny? Oh, yeah, we had to take a little bathroom break. Motherfuckers had to pee and shit. No, 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 no. No, no. Hell yeah. yeah but, should um, I, I'm talking about that story that time I texted where the, you. Where the fuck are we, yo? She, she like, got spice go in here. I, I don't know like, if y'all yeah. seen this week. You know what I'm talking about? But, uh, bro, Shaq and Country Kaylin, Wayne said that. Kaylin, tell me the story. Hot talk. A man should never open up to a woman. Hey, bro, we about okay. To it. Bro, it's bro. like Shaq, like Shaquille O'Neal, by the way. D Shaq and Country Wayne. A man should never open up to a woman in the sense of, like, confide his. To be vulnerable. Yeah, like with, with, with specific shit, of course. Like if he's going through something, a, a man yeah. should never let a woman know. But but before they answer, because I, I, I really want to hear what they say. W do you agree or do you not agree? I agree to an extent. Yeah, okay. I was say that. In, in, in the sense that like, there, there's times where um, you know. I think that there's times where, where it's very good if if that's your girl, that's your ace, you confide in her. And y'all can, you know, have those conversations and, and y'all can level each other out, provide balance and, and figure out a solution. There's other times, though, where maybe you exp you could express certain insecurities to a female. Mm -hmm. And the next thing you know, down the line, even if it's not her intention, she's kind of bringing it up and putting it in your face as to why she didn't do A, B, C or D. Because mm. she feel like you dealing with A, B, C, or D because of that trauma you, or something more. Because of what you already confided in her in the past. Mm. Mm. Which I think. And I don't think it's always toxic or intentional, but yeah. I agree with you to a certain extent. I feel like a man never has to tell me his insecurities because in a man, it's always going to come out. That's one thing. Like, men are not good at hiding their insecurities. Is it all insecurity, though? It may not even be insecurity, it could just be something he's going through. I yeah, mean, not, okay, but um, yeah. I mean, I don't have an issue. Like, like, like if he's going I through mean, financial problems, a, can, can a man a tell you? I mean, I come from a traditional like background, so my take on things is going to be a lot different. Because right, but why did why did you negate that directly to insecurities? What? 
That's because he, he he mentioned insecurities. That's the oh. only reason why I touched on that. But I'm saying, but moving what, forward, what, what, what I come wasn't from a that? traditional background, so I feel like a a man should handle a man's business and a woman should handle a, a woman's business. So what you I'm not saying what you're going through necessarily shouldn't be my problem. If he don't want to tell you, is that a problem? It shouldn't it shouldn't be my problem. No, if he doesn't want to confine in if you. If you don't want to tell me that no, but if if we're going uh, are to you fuck cool under with that? and I can save us though, now if we're going under and I'm our only safety net, tell me. Right, but are you tell are you are you are you okay me. with a man not wanting to Vent and let you know he's going through some shit or been through some shit. Are, I mean, but are you it depends cool with, on what. It's that's it depends on what. Well, Shaq is saying he's not doing it at all. He's saying I'm not opening up to you. I'm not. I'm not venting to you or telling you what I'm going through ever because of this reason. Are you cool with that? Are you I don't cool feel with like that? That's 100 true, though. I mean, he I'm said not, it straight. I'm he not said cool it. Him. With it. I feel like he needs I to agree, open but up to the, you. The, the key word is he said to a woman. So there's. Yeah, to a woman. There's a big difference between a woman and a girl, which would back his statement up if he was to. I think he meant open, both. But go ahead. Open. Okay, but so if yeah. he did, then he mean both. But the the difference is that I would say to a woman, there's no problem with that because a real woman is never gonna take what you tell them out of confidence and come back and throw it in your face. That's true. You type shit. That's true. A, a girl might take it for the time, and then as soon as she get mad at you or whatever, it might bring it up and throw it in your face, which could be the reason why guys don't feel comfortable being vulnerable. Because the girl's going to fucking throw it in your face all like, nigga, you was crying, when blah, 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 blah. But yeah, it's, just, yeah. it's just real crazy because, like, a, yeah, a man is a man and a female is a female, but we all have feelings. Right. We all, to think that somebody, like, don't ever care or get sad or cry about anything, is you would be with a fucking robot if that was the case, so... I agree and I disagree. I agree mm. for a girl, but for a woman, I disagree. If you confide in a woman and whatever, you should feel comfortable. Comfortable no, doing not it? Not at all. It's crazy because if I'm with a man, I'm telling you everything. I'm telling you everything. But it's well, different. Yeah, of course, of course you, you are. Even yeah, random of course you are. Like, yeah, of course. Beings. But with, with a man, I want that type of relationship. It could even be random. It don't even have to be. We could be out having a good ass night and then you randomly think about some shit or you see right. some shit. I want you to be able to um, tell me. No, no, I feel that. I, I think to both of y'all points is like, what, and what I saw from the internet was a lot of the men saying facts and a lot of the women saying that's some bullshit. That's, see, that's y'all niggas' problems now, right? That That's the parentheses of what I've seen going on. And I, what I feel like is, and, and this is me speaking from, I'm not speaking for all niggas because a lot of niggas, like what she said, have a lot of insecurities, aren't, aren't as alpha male as they think they is for real. They're not right. real. They're not, I'm not saying real niggas, but let's just say solid men. A lot yeah. of niggas ain't solid men, right? No, yeah, that's true. And so from my perspective, I'm one of those niggas that think like Shaq, but not all the way. Like I said, to an extent, like O said. Yeah. So for me, I don't really have, I'm not opening up to every woman. I'm not doing that, right? Mm -hmm. I, I I talk to my mom a lot, but even with my moms or a shorty that I love, for me, and I'm, I'm, and I'm gonna say this to women, I understand what y'all want us to vent, but if I'm going through it, at the moment, oh, right hand of God on my daughter's soul, I'm not telling you shit. I don't want to talk to nobody about nothing. That's man shit, though. Mm -hmm. Men are here to provide and protect. Yeah. And so while I'm figuring out that, then I don't want to talk about nothing. There's nothing for me to discuss. I'm all action till I figure this shit out. That's a nigga that's a hustler, though. That's mm -hmm. a that Hopefully you y'all dating somebody that is capable of, baby, we ain't got nothing right now, but give me 30 days and I'm going to flip this or make this work or make this happen. Right, no, that's all I need, though. Right, right. That's but, all I need. But, that's but, the but the issue is when they cut it like that and a woman feels like a man is not going to tell a woman at all. Now, I'm cool with chopping it up. I feel a lot better nowadays. I talk better now. Maybe it's because of my daughter or some women have checked me about it. But I, I am more capable of talking about things after I've solved it. Yeah, um, I, 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 I am cool with that. I, I am cool with saying, oh, like a woman, I, I might have went through some dark shit with a female. And we still cool. Like I ain't break the code or nothing. Right. But like she was mad at me at a specific time. That's not, yeah. that's not vulnerability to me. That's not, not vulnerable. Not, but I'm yeah. saying, it, but right, it's, it's but not. But 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 it's better. Yeah, it's better than nothing. Cause if I did something dirty at that time when I was in a dark place, you can because and later already... I was able to go. Damn, I didn't know. Like, oh, we, we've done this before with the movie shit. Remember, I was telling you like from 2008 to 2014, I had never worked that hard in my life. 
where I wasn't even enjoying shit that I loved. I wasn't going to basketball games. I wasn't watching movies. You know, I'm a movie freak. And you was telling, you was describing a movie to me. I was like, how did I see this? Like my main three favorite actors. Mm. And you was like, oh, it came out in 2009. I was like, bro, I, I didn't hang out with or date at all in that them six years. I literally was doing illegal shit. Clean. Well, sorry. I was. I literally was hustling. That whole Allegedly. time. So I was Allegedly. blacked out back then. And I, when girls described me from 2008 to two, 2015, bro, that shit sounds terrible. A different story. Because I'm like, I'm not even like that no more. So I'm, maybe I'll be able to talk about that later with a shorty and vent, okay, my bad shorty. And this year, my nigga died. My nigga got murdered. And I had yeah. just talked to him before he died. And I, I, was, I wasn't an artist then. And maybe I became a... And so I'm able to open up and vent about that later. But when we're in the thick of it, when we're going through our shit... I don't think any man should be have be should be communicating about what he's going through. There should be no therapy at that time. There should be no woman constantly asking him. I think a woman just needs to pay attention and help when she can. If it's small shit like just okay, he he ate late that day, like cook for him that day. Yeah, it don't always good. gotta be me talking to you in a therapy session. No, like pay feel. attention to me and just help me out. Look out for me. Like stay at the crib and hold the kids down while I go bust a move let real quick or something. That's yeah, what I, I feel like is better. That's what I got from it. I agree. Yeah, I, you know what I mean. I feel like in an ideal world, but I also feel like energy's a motherfucker, man. You know, like sometimes yeah. you don't have to say energy's, shit. Energy's a motherfucker. So it's like if a motherfucker acting different or more closed off, you can naturally be like men to women and women to men. Like, well, what's up with you? Why are you acting like that? Or why are you being different? Or why are you being closed off? Or why are you being... And then it's like, how macho is you at that point to where yeah. when she asks you what's up, you say 50, 50 times in a row to where what? You get to the 50 time, you slap the shit out of her to get her to drop I think it. I, I like, agree. what's the, what, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, I agree with saying, like, how you were saying, like, at the time, in the moment, a man, like, yeah, you got. So, if I uh -huh. ask, like, if, if we're together and I say, like, what's wrong with you? You can give me a scratch to the surface. Like, I'm not telling you to, like, go into detail and tell me every little thing exactly what's wrong with you, but give me something because if not, then I'm going to get into my my own self and think, yeah. I might start to think it's me and that's only going to cause right. more problems because at the time when you need me there, I'm in here in my head thinking, what am I doing? What am I doing? Now we on yeah. two different pages when I really just need to be being here for you. A nigga might nutshell it saying, though. I feel like a lot of solid niggas nutshell it. Like I might, I'm yeah. not going to tell you, I might be like, you can, yo, like, I'm on the ground right now. You can now. just leave it like real. I'm locked in right now. Oh, and, and I'm that's okay for a that. reason. Cause if if I'm if I'm already set, I'm not hustling like this. So right. common sense to tell you is somebody in my family I gotta feed. There's some bills that gotta be paid. So I might and I'm not gonna do the women thing where it's like I'm not gonna tell you how my day was every day. Mm -hmm. I'm a, babe, what you doing? Working. Babe, how was your day? Good. Good. Are you yeah. okay? And I'm never gonna be like no. What type? What nigga says no when you ask? Are you okay? I will say this though. I appreciate you asking though. I appreciate you checking on me and asking, but I'm never going to tell you if I'm not okay, if I'm not okay. As a man, I have to pick my chin up and keep it pushing. As a man. That's just what it is. So would you allow, like... Um, Has a nigga like, ever said no? Like, I'm not okay? Like, to you? like Owen was saying, yes, but I done dealt with a lot of pussy-ass niggas. Shout out to y'all. <laughs> but um, far as not real, solid, okay. solid men, no, real men not gonna do that. Yeah. But like he was saying, some things you don't have to say. So if you are a real solid woman with this man, something, what's understood ain't gotta be explained. Long sure. story short, some things like I have to ask you, like, is you okay? You can be like, yeah, but it's just work, and I'll leave it at that. I'll know that you don't have to go into detail about it. Or some things you don't gotta say at all. I just see it, like you said, you ain't eight. I'm gonna just do that. So it's I just like you for that. a, you, you know, what I'm yeah, it's just like a paying attention type of thing. For sure. Vice versa, when is it too much for a female? Because we're emotional as females. Mm -hmm. When is it too much on a man when a female is pouring all of her like every detail, like this and that? It we're could be a lot. This, I've, like, I've literally, I've literally, this is me. I can't speak for all these niggas. I've literally stopped talking to a female because I felt like. And she was a dope ass woman, mm. but I was like, she got too much shit going like on. Like every time I talk to you, yes, it's always something. Every time I talk to you, you dealing with something with your baby daddy, with your parents, with your friends, with your kid, and it's like it's cool. But I might see something small and be like, I don't think I could deal with that. You know, I might see something small like she might be, she might be like, I, like letting her child do too much, like just like yeah. babying them too. Much. I'm like, I can't. I, I've already took put enough time into my kids to be. Self-efficient, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm, but now right. I gotta start all over with you just cause I like you, no. and you over just. But that's the, not your, your job, huh? That's, yeah, it, it is, is, Kayla. Yes, oh. it is. 
Yes, it, it is. is. The package. Too. Yes, it is. No, I mean, no, it is to a certain extent. But what I'm saying is, everything can have an extent. I feel but like, like no, everything can have an extent because it's like. <sighs> I mean, well, I ain't got kids. To talk That's the name to of the episode, kids. by the way. But all I'm saying is, as a woman, I feel like oh. it's my job to also be self-sufficient to a certain extent. Once, once, let me just say this. Once a man enters your life and you have a child, he is now... Yeah, I say I ain't got kids, so I can't speak to kids, but I'm just talking. Right. Speaking. Well, you know, right. The thing about a child, like, if I'm around you, that kid is not is, is, act a certain way differently around me than I have my own kids. If I was, right. Right. I pay attention but, to that though. That's key. I mean, like I said, you don't have children, so yeah, I can't you know, necessarily speak to kids. But right, right. That 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 is might, that is, that is a big point. I'm not knocking you for not having children. Salute for, to you for taking your time because I did it the wrong way twice. So, and my kids are my blessings. But yeah, no kids the yeah nah, right. But uh, oh, oh, first yeah, of all, hey, no. <laughs> oh, first of all, tell her what you really think. What do I really think. You believe if a woman doesn't have children, her pussy is trash. That's not I true. I snitched though. I have footage. Well, that was a that. meme. That was amazing. That wasn't a meme. You you said that. Yeah, That's but it, not true. One second. You vouch for that? <laughs> Can I clean this up? Did you vouch for that meme? Yes. Bro? O says if you Nola? don't have children, Nola your pussy's trash. Kaylin. I wish yeah. I could call no, somebody no, no, right no, no, now and speak in front of them and be like... No, no, no. Oh, Nola, I, I ain't mean to put you all in. I'm no, sorry. That's fine. You, you did because you're a fuck boy. But listen. <laughs> Nola and Kaylin. One second. One second. <laughs> Take a sip. It really don't bother and me. And make him dip. I know it does. Y'all see it. It's y'all But listen, it. I was on live one night, and a chick was talking shit, trying me. Mm -hmm. And I said, do you have kids? She said, no. I said, because your pussy trash. He thinks so that. But I'm not saying I stand by that. I'm saying she was talking whatever white boy shit she was talking, so I found something to nitpick at. Okay. You son of a bitch. My bad, bro. I love you. Next I get that, because you know you got to go low. Subject. When they go low, you go lower type shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so subject, how do you actually it. feel, though? He so, just told so you. I feel, like, I feel like a woman having good pussy is subjective. It's person by person. Mm. Like, some some women, real shit, because I don't want to get too deep into shit, but I'm saying some women can just lay there and not even fuck good, and, yeah. the, and the quality of how the pussy feels is chef's kiss. Other women, maybe the pussy's a little less, but they can ride a dick mean, twerk on the dick, do all sorts of tricks, the actual fuck game is superb. Mm -hmm. It's neither here nor there, because neither one of y'all do neither. Um, tough crowd. I'm just kidding. I do both. Um, no, I'm just playing. I do both. But yo, in the face. but no, it depends. <laughs> but no, but no, real shit. Yo, what's <laughs> what's what's the main reason? Oh, like nigga lost his mind. <laughs> what's the main reason that a woman would disappear off of social media, to y'all? Pregnant. Pregnant. Ooh. And Bow. new nigga that's insecure. Bow. Facts. Yes. Is this a period? Facts. Yeah, they stopped posting. Post that? They, yeah. they, they were consistent. She got pregnant. She didn't want nobody to know, especially all them niggas that she did, was still slick talking to. So she held off for a long time and stopped posting. And then when it was time to do the reveal thing, because y'all go take them fucking photos. Then we oh, it's out, blue. It's a boy. Out. Right. And then out of, out of nowhere, we see you post that you was pregnant the whole fucking time. Yeah. Or you have an insecure wrong. nigga. Right. You have an insecure nigga. You got a new nigga. You think you done made it, and you get with this nigga. He, got and he, he wants you to get beat. off. He all through. He went through your phone. He done went through your DMs. He Facts. Got, he got good dick, and he's beating on you. Is Damn. There a hidden camera. God forbid. Like... No, I'm saying Johnny? for real. It's the boyfriend, <laughs> and it's the pregnancy. <laughs> and then why? Why is it when all of a sudden? A, there's a third thing. Uh oh. Oh, what is it? Because I don't know it. So, me, I'm I'm a weirdo, and going through some stuff. Depressed? Sometimes I just don't, sometimes I want to like I post like back to back back to back and sometimes I just want to disappear out the face of the fucking earth. Inconsistent. But I can vouch for I can't vouch for the pregnancy shit because I ain't never been pregnant before. But I can vouch for the insecure never? nigga shit for sure. Plan B. You never yeah. been pregnant before. No, I never took a plan B either. I just never been pregnant before, and not because my pussy can trash. We, can we ask you? Shit, I don't shit think valid. that. But, Nola, but I don't think I don't that. Just, I don't be can we ask your abortion count on here? Huh? Yeah, yeah I've count. never had any. Y'all no can Google back, fact check. Y'all can Google if I've had I never one. I've what? never How had many times you plug a baby? baby? I have no, look, never. Get the fuck out of here. On my mother, and you know get I would the, never do okay. that. Uh, rest in peace, mom. Oh, yeah, facts. No I've plan never B's, had a no plan abortions. B. Never had an abortion. Well, that's good news, boys and girls. Um, is the this first time. The it just for this me. girl's got a. This girl's the fifth element. She's got a multi pass. So my mom, I'm I'm 28. I'm about to be 29. My mom didn't have her name's Lilu. Shut the Let's fuck cut up. cut the shit, bro. My mom Hold didn't on. have me, so she was 32. So she just always just said I'm green, just a late bloomer. Super green. 
<laughs> I'm just a late bloomer, guys. It's no, no thing. Multi pass is crazy. Sorry, what age is no, your nuts start fine. hanging? Because what? we're gonna your nuts make it start happen. hanging to like what? last year, so it's like the same thing. I'm, I'm f- <laughs> might be fertile. I don't know. <laughs> Hold I, on. I, I got a son, daughter, and I'd have had an abortion. No, but Ka- I mean, side. Okay, well, like. You called me Kayla? Five no, years, I didn't. Six years ago. You should, try, you, you should try this thing that they've been doing for a while. It's called pull I out. I want to. I want the drama. Also, sometimes, like, I want a baby daddy. Want abortion? The le- right Just one. like a baby daddy, right, like, for the drama, okay. for the plot. Yeah, they it's what so boring. Fuck? Everybody I know has a baby daddy or something. Bruh. I'm just like, hold on. I'm at peace. <laughs> hold on, guys, before I come with myself. Kayla, have you. Ever taken a plan B? It's not as fun, I promise. Or a plan C? Or had to abort the plan A? I don't, and and change the sport? I don't feel like Kaylin is going to speak on shit like no, that. No, Kaylin keeps it a buck she always. Nah, she keeps it a buck. What? <laughs> <laughs> you asked how many abortions yet? Did you nah, that Kaylin is not kicking that type of shit. What? I ain't had no abortions. For real? Mm, Kills them. I like plan these two of them. Plan B? What, a plan B? Yeah, yeah. I took a plan B before. Yeah, I mean, yeah. yeah. Side huh? note, real quick, just question for I mean, I've educational probably... purposes. Does a plan B feel like anything? No. Why? Why, nigga? What do you mean, why? why? You need one? Well, <laughs> if we paid you, oh, if we paid you <laughs> to take, to take a plan B, how much? Five dollars. <laughs> five dollars? A dance nah. at Blue Flame. <laughs> you gotta do a, a five dollar dance. <laughs> no. What's the side effects for a man to take a plan Hell B? Hell nah, Shadi. <laughs> Yo. No, but listen. Also... Yo, what if the plan B is the plan A? What do we call it then? Wait, what the What's fuck it? is that? I'm just saying, what if your first decision... I'm saying by default, the product is called plan B. But what if the first decision you make is to take the plan B? It's technically plan A. Yeah, what? and then to keep the baby oh, baby, the plan B. Oh, I see yeah. what you're saying. You already decided, like, yeah, yeah. I'm going to get happens, I'm gonna get a- I done oh. tricked the shorty. Yeah, is oh. no, no... I already told you guys how I feel about fluids. Anywhere fluids? Necessary. Who yeah. plays? Who pays for the plan B? What do you mean? Or do y'all go half? What you mean what I mean? On $50? I'll, How much is it? $50? I'll I'll you know, I'll I'll you know. I'm not I don't. I'll be you know the price? Po- I'll be seeing it. posts. You know the price? No. I'm going to keep I mean, it a I mean, I'm going to a strip club full of people. Who pays getting, for the plan B? I'm, I'm not getting nothing. But can I be real with you? Anybody, nigga, if you're going to pay for it, I'm not going to be stuck with a kid because I want to come off $50. I don't live $60. Oh, so the nigga don't got to pay for the plan B? Maybe, yeah. You don't have to. I'll probably pay for one before. $25? Damn, Chase. That's crazy. Chase got a discount on playing bees. That's insane. I literally don't know. <laughs> That's insane. Hold on. One time, though, at band camp, there was this chick, right? Mm-hmm. Her name was Quana. Mm-hmm. We're going to talk about it. But she stumped me in her dorm room. This is a true story. <laughs> and I was kind of tired at night, but I <laughs> went over there with the intention to get some pussy. But then I got tired once I got in the bed. We're laying in the bed. Martin's on the TV on reruns. As mm-hmm. it always is. She's on the outside of the bed. I'm on the inside, actually, by the wall. I roll over to go to sleep. And I hear the TV, Word. and then I hear her press a button, and I hear R. Kelly, girl, you make me want to get you pregnant. Huh. Hmm. I'm hmm. like, damn, so I, I got to fuck. Word. Thick joint, too. Mm-hmm. Fat ass. I, I wasn't really on my game that night. Word. I started hitting from the back. I'm mm-hmm. like, damn, I'm about to last like five minutes, maybe. It's Bro. Going crazy. It was, yeah, it was amazing. Bro. Right. So then she's like, <laughs> right, <laughs> right. So she goes, she goes, she side real shit. She goes, she want to get on top. Mm-hmm. I'm already off my game, and I'm mm-hmm. like, if she gets on top, there's no way I'm hanging in there. Mm. She gets on top. It comes time to where I'm, I'm about to bust. I bust in that jaw. Mm. She was thick joint too, so I, I mm-hmm. wasn't finna just dismount right. properly. Let it rip. Right, right. So I, I bust in that joint. The next day happens. Mind you, I was out of town. I was out of town visiting wherever I was, like mm-hmm. two hours away, three hours away. I'm heading back home the next morning. She texts my phone, which is just cap. But she goes, hey, did you wear protection last night? Because um, I just feel like, you know, whatever. Basically, she was saying, like, you came at me, motherfucker. What's up? Mm-hmm. What are we doing? Okay. Let me tell you how I mind fucked her. Okay. Sorry. I was like, oh, no, I didn't wear protection. I figured if you were letting me come inside of you raw, that you were responsible enough to be on the pill. Nope, doesn't work. And and this this is the shit. This is the ignorant shit niggas be thinking, y'all. Mind you, doesn't work. Mind you, I'm like 1920 at the time. This is this is a while. Oh yeah, you get away with that 1920. You thought yeah. you mindful. She fucked you. <laughs> she got 12 mm. But listen. She did fuck me though. Cause you never asked if she would have responded and said, "Well, I thought you were responsible enough to ask me 
Right. If I was on the field this before like he fucking young busted me. <laughs> too young motherfucker, but, but I told her I was like, yo, I was like, I thought if you was letting me hit raw, you was responsible enough to be on the pill. No, oh my God. I, I'm not on the pill. You can't da, da da da. So she ended up like taking her roommate's card and getting a plan B or whatever. Mm. But I finessed her into a plan you B. You ain't pitching? No. That's good. That's Get crazy. Away. Yeah, so. no. I shouldn't pitch in. It's your pussy, right? Right. <laughs> Next. You pitched it. Please. Good call. Good call. Good call. Good call. Fucking last. Shit was finna go south. <laughs> Kayla. Hey, for both of y'all, separately, right? Simultaneously. Mm -hmm. What are What are you mostly not sorry or like unapologetic about? Sorry, not sorry. What are you most not sorry or like unapologetic about as a woman? What's something you don't got time to explain? You ain't got time to clarify. You don't. It's just it's you. Standing step on, on it. Stand on that shit. Oh. Ten toes. Hmm. You least what sorry am about. I least sorry about. Most unapologetic I about. I mean, I don't know. nothing. Mm -mm. Well, I, I'll Lola. answer. I am the very fucking least sorry about being who the fuck I am. Who, um, man, I ain't finna say. I be trying, I tweak little things, you know, because I want to be better for myself, not for another person, though. Mm -hmm. But once I feel that I'm good in my head, I don't really feel bad about anything. And I can honestly do the worst shit and not feel bad about it. What? Not gonna lie, I'm going to sleep good, snoring, drooling, everything. That's real. I'm not sorry for, mm. um, you know, being passionate, it comes across as aggressive, so I've heard. Mm. I can't apologize for that. I'm passionate about the shit and the people that I love, and that's just how I stand on it. And, yeah, I'm just not sorry for being me. If you don't like me, baby. Hmm. Exit stage left. Exit stage left. Drop the fucking mic. Get out of here. I don't care. I feel it. Even if you do like me, I still don't care because I probably don't like you. Right. Mm. That's a fact. I don't know. I feel I'm not that. sorry for being myself. I'm not sorry for being Is this a list? anything. I don't know. I'm just gonna You're not keep sorry going for being on. Sorry. Nobody else wants to answer. <laughs> I'm not sorry for being sorry, bitch. I'm sorry. But I'm not sorry for being sorry. You feel me? Yeah. For sure. I'm with you, gang. Feel me? Well, nigga. You don't feel for sure. Me. I do. Well. I'm glad I feel you. I'm okay, saying. you feel me. I'm glad yeah, I feel like, you. I'm sorry you feel that way, but like I'm not sorry that I made you feel, feel you. that way. I guess I could just say I'm not sorry for living, for experiencing things. Mm. I feel like I didn't have a blueprint to do a lot of stuff. So uh, the decisions that I do make, I'm not sorry for them at all. Because like mm. I said, I don't have a blueprint. That's a fact. You living in real time. Yeah, yeah. But practically. like Unapologetically. Yeah, I had no yeah. choice. Hell yeah. I fuck with that. Amen. Well, I fuck with it too. Unconditionally. <laughs> 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 Episode, Unconditional. Right. Yeah, hey, I want to so redo mine. I did have a list. I don't like that. Go ahead. No, Let me redo, redo mine. Shit. I like no redo shit. shit. I don't know. I Ain't no redo. redo. Ain't no redo. Shit was heat though. You know what? Video shoot. You're right. I'm not sorry. Yeah, you said Facts. what you said. Stand on that not shit. Not sorry. <laughs> Pull your shit out like Drake and stand on it. Man. <laughs> um. <laughs> but nah. So this the this the segment of the episode where we get to the why ass side. Mm-hmm. And uh, mm -hmm. yeah. We got an official YSI right here. What we got? Let's see how this shit goes. So I, I need everybody to listen up. Goddamn. Hold on. Sorry. What up? Oh, what, what's good? My name is Kayla Robinson. I'm from Canton, Ohio. Kayla Robinson from Canton, Ohio. Okay, what's up, Kayla? Question is that I just want advice on, like, for, like, good men. Like, I'm dealing with a situation right now. By the way, Kayla has a FedEx uniform on. Fun fact. Just Play it through. Okay, cool. Yeah, Thank you. Can I hear it? That been through trauma. I mean, <laughs> been through everything. Like, she got cheated on and this and that. And now it's, like, to the point that now it's, like, due to her past situations, she taking out on me. And it's, like, girl, I, I'm not the man, so why you keep comparing me to your last, your last situations? Mm. And so at this point, I just, like, I just want some advice on, like, what would you tell good men that's out there that's still go doing good but dealing with a female that mm. deals with 
past situations. Mm. That's a really. What's my man name again? What's my man name? I think he said Kaylin. I'm. I, 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 Sorry. What up? Let me get my man name right. Kayla. 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 Kayla Robinson. Kayla uh, Robinson. Yeah, Kayla. so but we look, I got a whole song about this specific subject. So it's like, Kayla, let me keep it a buck with you. Like, I got a song called Hill for Once, and I don't know if you're familiar with it, but it's one of my biggest songs. But it's basically about that exact situation that you're dealing with. So it's me asking a female, why do I have to continuously deal with the past trauma that you had from the, from another nigga that I have nothing to do with. I may I may I may have done nothing of the sort to you, but you dealt with it so much um, that you now have transferred it to our relationship. For one, and I'm speaking to you. I'm, I, I can't school you, shorty. You said to speak to a good man. You got to stop selecting women that haven't healed yet. Mm, that was mm. literally. You have to stop choosing women that have not healed yet. Mm -hmm. That woman, because women date way more than us, by the way. We may fuck recklessly and hit whoever. We Dogs could be dogs. But women, they will have a nigga and then date another nigga right after that without properly healing. Some women will. Not all women are doing that. So you, in turn, have to pay attention to the signs to make sure that she's still healed. Because as you're talking to this woman on her first date or the second date or the third date, you're asking her how long you've been single. You know, you should be asking the key questions. You should know what have she, has she dealt with. She's going to open up a little bit. You know what I mean? Whatever wine she like to drink, whatever like she like to drink, she's going to open up a little bit. And you can tell if some of those things that she's described that that last dude did, you should be able to notice if she's protecting herself from you doing that when you ain't even doing it at all. And so I feel like you need to take your time. She hasn't healed yet. And you need to make sure that you find your woman that has healed or give this woman time to heal. And she needs to show that, okay, you know what? I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt, and I'm not going to react this way. Now, Caleb, if she does give you the benefit of the doubt, do not fuck that up. Because if you do that, then you're going to double her pain, and she's going to have a hard time healing for the next nigga. So if you are this good nigga that you describe, if, if the last nigga was putting his hands on her, and now you may, you may have like would have grabbed her arm a little bit, she was like, don't touch me, but you didn't even mean it like that. If you put your hands on her now, that shit crashes. So just make sure that you don't do those things that he, that she did describe that traumatize her. Because a lot of niggas do. A lot of you niggas run that early game and end up being somebody later. So, Caleb, hopefully you allow her to heal, she heals, and that you don't break your promise on that and do the things that the last nigga did. And that's my answer to the YSI. Amen. Mm -hmm. Ladies, how y'all feel? Y'all close Am I preaching, Caleb? I can't sign it. I don't want to say too much it. now in front of Caitlyn because I feel like I once we, I pass the sentence. I think we need a back like question we to him. Do we need a counter to him. All I'm saying is, I feel counter like you need to leave yeah. her. That's all I'm going to say. I feel like he needs to leave her. We need a counter Like suit. you said, his shit's not healed. And I feel like I'm a big advocate of don't answer something unless you're ready to answer it. Get what I'm saying? I will say this. More than being healed, though, I think we all learn from our experiences. Yeah, but I, at the same time... Go ahead, I was going to say that I feel like as a woman, maybe you might date however many motherfuckers yeah. And you see, and you see a trend, or you see something where you're like, like, "I've seen this before X amount of times." And so, even though a new motherfucker might come along, and maybe he don't present them same issues, it's hard to just step out on okay. faith okay, and be like, "Oh, he not like the past that's thirteen you're, motherfuckers." That's, that's because you're not healed, right? Sure. You're, you're, you're gotta or, be willing but, to walk into a situation. You gotta be smart enough to walk into a situation maybe. and analyze it for what it is. Maybe, but so also you gotta use your past trauma as knowledge. Rather than using it as a, a guarding mechanism, you can't use it as right. a, a mechanism to he, keep he wouldn't guarding. respond. I was gonna say, but that's what I'm saying though, in the sense of it, let's, let's say I, <laughs> but let's, no, that's not what you're saying. Niggas be ready to say something back before a girl even finish her sentence. It is. Let, let's, he, let's, was hold, said, he was holding it you in. You said, I'm about, to, I'm about to tell you. I'm about to tell you. That's what niggas be doing. Let's say, let's say they let's, be ready to answer you before you finish. You done? Keep in mind, I'm gonna you counter suit when you guys are done. I'm gonna counter suit. You know what I'm You done? I just want y'all to hear each other so we can end this. But go ahead. I did hear. I did hear Kayla. And Kayla heard me. We right, good right. over here. Mm -hmm. That's cool. We always do. I'm just saying, let's say I walk home from work every day, right? Mm -hmm. And five out of ten times, a fucking Rottweiler comes out of nowhere and bites me in the ass. Mm -hmm. Am I wrong <laughs> for picking a new the fucking sixth way time home you think it's not on the happen. sixth time? <laughs> No, you're not exactly. wrong for picking and a new hey, home, that's but my that's, same that's logic. you being That's not trust issues. I don't trust the street. There's that's, dogs that come out and bite my meat. That's it's not, not the you, same fucking thing. I'm, I'm, I say that to say we, we are creatures of habit. If you date eight motherfuckers in a row over the course of eight years and you see a trend on a ninth motherfucker, if you were a little shaky and you expect some shit, even if it ain't there, are you flawed for that? 
No, I'm not saying that. That's not. But maybe what I'm that's the key. What you just said. Right. You taking the same path. Right. Maybe what people need to do different results. Is, Change it up. Yeah, that's insane. Be knowledgeable about it. You're taking the same it. path and expecting something else. <laughs> yes. Maybe what you should do is go down another street. Right. And then if you're still expecting to get bit by a dog, then you have issues. Exactly. But if you're going down a different street, be open and you know. Right. That's like different shit. Exactly. There you go. Thanks. Mm -hmm. My counter suit, Caleb. I'm gonna get to you. <laughs> I do have a counter suit though, because I'll face up what you said. Um, stop dealing with women who's healed, not fully healed. Mm -hmm. Are you fully healed? Because why? Are, what? What are you? What level are you vibrating on that's causing you to attract women that's not fully healed? Maybe you yourself are not fully healed, and that you wouldn't keep running into the same uh, situations. And I'm speaking Maybe to myself he likes too. That. And that's Maybe a part you of do. the problem. Maybe you don't. <laughs> yeah, why you know, asking questions about may something never that you know. like? Because. <laughs> I think like you gave good advice though. I, mean, so, yeah. I wasn't preaching. Like, I mean, preach advice, whatever the fuck. Feelings. You know, it's irrelevant. The delivery is irrelevant. Her, her feelings for me. His feelings. The delivery is. I feel like, I feel like a love motherfucker love don't love always know. Like, y'all can start fucking, start kicking, and start whatever, and then X amount of months or a year down the road, then, then something rears its head to where we go, damn, she got trust issues. But in the thick of it, we know about a honeymoon stage. We know about when shit's sweeter than it really is. So in that stage, we don't yeah. really know. We don't really know what it really is. <laughs> we we just ride yeah. them with the good moments, and, I then, mean, and then a year down the road, we find you out. You don't. You don't really you know what it is. But at the same time, okay. it's like if you're rocking with somebody, you should be able to take that time to have that conversation to be like, look. But that's what everybody. So that's if, why everybody just needs to keep, keep it the fuck real. Stop beating around the bush. Stop fake kicking it. Whatever the fuck. Be who you is on the jump. That way you don't waste your time and the next person's time. And that's keep it fact. moving, motherfucker. If you if if I ain't shit. I'm gonna tell you that if I want to cheat and whatever, if that's what you yeah, want, we want it. Shit. But if not, see, because it hits different if you do it later. But the, not because you did it, but because you told me you wasn't, you wasn't like that. That's what is the problem. So everybody keep it real, or keep it the fuck away from me. I don't know. Yeah, there it is. Whoop! I fuck with y'all. Mm -hmm. I love you, black sisters. How are you? It was a pleasure I had y'all on. Um, <laughs> I appreciate y'all for coming on the third episode. Pause. And being our first guest, it was fun. We had some spicy moments, some real moments, some disagreements. But um, I respect y'all as women. Um, I respect y'all opinions. This was dope. This was fun. I had a good time. And uh, we'll see y'all again. You too. Thank you for having me. To the next episode. Holla, gang. Holla. <laughs> good job. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>